today. Let's talk about today. We're going to go into a, a new game in an existing world. I already built this world because it took a lot of, of generations to try to find what I want. The Everlasting Realm, they call it. Or Realms, they call it. And I'm going to show you what I've found here and what the plan is. I've done this before on uh, As Old Asky Dwarf Fortress, where I tried to build a... I, I came into a world that didn't have any dwarves in it, or very few dwarves in it, and I tried to rebuild the civilization. I came in every... I, 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 every time I came in, I built a new fortress and tried to expand the empire, um, and I failed, because every time I changed fortresses, the goblins would come in and take my fortresses out. So we're trying it again, and I'm going to show you the map that I've got here. I've got a map that started out with some good uh, amount of dwarves. We're 250 years in here. One of the civilizations got wiped out by goblins. And the other one got attacked by humans, mostly wiped out by humans. There is, on this world, there are the Reclusive Quakes is the name of our empire, and there are 46 dwarves. Zon Pleated Paddles is the queen of this shambles of an empire. So what I want to do is rebuild it. So we've got uh, everyone else. Also, I want to make sure everyone else is still here. What I did is on, the, on the world gen is it's like a medium-sized world. I put in, I think, a low civilizations, and I put high on savagery, beasts, and whatever the other one is, um, sites. And um, just, I simulated this probably took 10 different worlds, maybe more than that, to try to find one that, I, that came out looking like I wanted it. So we've got the elves up over here. Uh, Woman Pack is the name of that forest retreat. Uh, Roadblocked and uh, and blazes shoved. A bunch of elves living up here. Uh, so you can see the two dwarven empires that began this were all right in here. You can see all the ruins uh, in here. These were all conquered by goblins, and you can see they are now goblin. Well, that one's been run over, but there's some goblin places here. There we go. There's a goblin hillock, for instance. Taken over by goblins. Outrageous. Uh, we've got the humans over here we're at war with came in and attacked and took out this empire that we had. So that was all the dwarves. There are elves living here. I think that's the only two elves I've seen on the map. And there are a lot of goblins and other things. There's more humans actually up here. The same empire? How do I know? I don't know how to tell if this is the same people or not. Yeah, I'm not sure. But there's humans kind of all scattered all through here. And we've got, looks like a tomb, and uh, there's a, mon a human monastery. Oh, yeah, yes, humans all kind of sprinkled in here as well. Humans are all over the place. Humans have done well. Actually, they're all down here, too. Um, and then, of course, we've got the uh, the dark elven pits and the uh, the gar dark goblin fortresses, and there's a tower there of humans. So uh, what we're going to do here is find a place to begin our empire. Now, I've been thinking that we either go... Um, I think somewhere around here, like we could, we could like hide out, like over here where no one is, but that's not very exciting. I don't want to be like, we can even be on this island and then, and then connect ourselves and expand. Maybe, you know, actually that would be, potentially that would be a thing we could do, but I want some excitement, so we're going to go and, and be in the action. And I've got two places to choose from. I've got um, over here, kind of a nice typical dwarven fortress right in here. Against this, it looks like there was a good, uh, there's a nice cliffside there. We can, like, build in the cliffside, Moria style. Um, or, the other option was to come down here. There's actually two spots here, into the sand. And we can build, like, a big pyramid. Which I kind of want to do. Big dwarven pyramid. Maybe not glass this time. Um, there's an aquifer there, but we can deal with that. Uh, and there's also some stuff down here. There's a big um, sand deserts all around this way also. And these are all in range of everyone else. There's humans, elves, and goblins all nearby. So, I think... I kind of like the idea of this big desert, but I like this little this little patch right here. There's something about it. Something about this patch is calling my name. There's no good cliffs here, so we're going to have to be just sort of just in the desert and get a, the occasional scarce tree. Might bring a couple of, of uh, bits of wood with us when we go out here, but we can get, get ourselves a nice pyramid. I think that's what I want to do. I wouldn't have any any requests, any ideas. Um, but then I, what I want to do is I'm going to come in here and we're gonna we're gonna build this one up, maybe a, a day, maybe two, um, and get a nice fortress. Like maybe we get like a, like a hundred folks in here or something if we can. It's gonna be kind of difficult because there's not really any any migrants out there. There's only the 46 living out there in those other places. So we'll see how this works. Um, and um, 
world with babies and stuff like that. Um, was there any volcanoes over here? I saw one. I thought. There's one up there. That's, that's not connected to us. That's it. Yeah, it's only, only volcano I see. Thanks, uh, Iggy. <sighs> Trying to build an above-ground castle. We already did an above-ground fortress, but a pyramid sounds kind of cool. So I think I want to try that. It's called the Cyclopean Irons, is the name of that brook. I like it. We were just in the Cyclopean universes. Let's do it. Right in here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to like nestle myself up in here. I'm going to make it uh, not, quite, not quite that big. Let's go something like a little bit smaller, like... Maybe like a 3x3. Three three. It's probably plenty big. And like nest nestled in, like right in here. Yeah, a step pyramid would be cool. An inverted pyramid, yeah. I think... I'm trying to think if I want to go a little smaller, like a, like a nice, nice tiny one. Like a nice little two by two. Tiny. We're, we're tiny people. We're going to build a tiny fortress. Right in there. Okay. So, enemies on. We want to prepare carefully for this one. And uh, we're going to go get ourselves some, some folks. So, I want to make... Uh, I don't need a miner. We'll get mining in a minute. All I really care about is having... Um, so, we'll get one person that knows how to fight. We know how to shield and armor... And um, and fighting, no skills left, do you? Knows how to fight, and um, yeah, something like that. What if we just give everyone skills in that? I think maybe I'm gonna do that because if because there's a lot, it's a savage world, uh, and so maybe if we if everyone knows how to fight, maybe there's, there's less likely a chance of us to die. Where's Dodger? There it is. So we'll do like we'll do like four fighters. And we'll see if we can get a um, see if we can get a, a, a somewhat. Did, did I do Mace Dwarf on you? Mace Dwarf. Not a Mace Dwarf. Get yourself, get yourself an axe, buddy. And we'll make sure we bring we'll bring five axes because we need one to, for chopping trees. Shields, armor, fighting, dodging. So yeah, if you want a dwarf in this fortress, now um, I'm hoping to stick with this for a while, and so we'll like build multiple fortresses. And so if you want a dwarf in here, you just, there's a good chance you're going to show up in other places. Um, I would appreciate some sand themed dwarves, though. We're building up in a in a sand theme, so um, our our caravan leader, expedition leader, his his Moadib, we call him. I, I don't know, um, something uh, um, fitting. Uh, let's get a, uh, I do want a doctor, so we're going to get someone who knows how to dress some wounds and um, that kind of stuff. I think that's all I really care about is those. <laughs> that. Hey, Tangier, thank you for, for the resub. Six months. Sorry, Tangier. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, um, everyone else is in bed, so it's a, it's a good time for me to stream. I want a good appraiser. An organizer. You're gonna. Uh, I'm gonna have you just do a kind of everything here. We'll make you kind of our our leader. Yeah, that's probably good. And then what's niche gonna do? What, is there anything we need? Maybe a farmer. Like all these. None of these skills really matter. We're gonna find some. And may, maybe we'll. I mean, once we do the job, we'll get better at it. So we'll get ourselves a brewer, and we'll have one guy do the brewing, and the farming. Um. Farmer not in here. We could have one. There's planting. Um, could have one do like fishing. Um, ah, eh, we'll give him a job. So we brewing, planting. That's it. I'm happy with that. And then and then Mason when you're not doing anything else. Twelve hours <laughs> yesterday. Uh, okay, so now for our stuff. Uh, what animals are we gonna bring? That's a good question. We could bring. I always do. Um, like, what well, we could do with our We could do some sort of animal that has thread, so we can we can sew them and get thread that way. Or we just do pigtails. Hmm. Stick with our basics for now. We will get a couple cats. I think we're gonna. We may farm cats because 
I like the farm cats. I'm sorry. Um, cats make a great thing to farm because they're good to have around because they will take care of any vermin. And they also, they make a good thing to eat. So we'll get a puppy. Uh, we'll get a, uh, a girl puppy and a boy puppy. Uh, actually, no, we'll, just, we'll take a dog. Boy dog. And girl dog. And then a goose for combat. Like we could get, we could do llamas. They're just expensive. Except that's why I don't ever do that. They're just too expensive. Uh, I would like some some chickens or something. There's turkeys. Turkeys were fighting all the time last time. Did chickens fight as much? Let's do ducks. You know we're in the we're in the desert. Ducks love the desert. Never mind. I can't bring any ducks. Okay, we'll bring a uh, rooster and like four hens. That'll give us that'll give us some some eggs and. I think I'm happy with that. Yeah, that's 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 a decent amount. Okay, so now items. Keep all the basic stuff. Um, I want more. Look, well, take a couple more pigtails. I don't know if I even need those. We'll leave it at like six. But I will grab some more plump helmets. I don't need cave wheat. Sweet pods. Or nuts. Or dimple comp. No, we don't need this. We'll find it if we need it. Uh, I'm gonna bring more battle axes. I'll stick with the basic copper ones. We want five of those because we want one person with chopping trees and the other guys are going to be using them for axes. We'll take two picks is fine. Uh, I'm going to bring a little extra of these so we'll be an extra barrel. And a few more plump helmets. Attempting to build another... Uh, would that give me another bag? Yeah. Um, like buckets and things. I can make those real easy. Well, you know what? Maybe I can't make them easy. There might not be a lot of trees around here. We can make it real easy. We can just buy some wood. Wheelbarrow, staff ladder, those are expensive and easy to, to replace. So let's go ahead and bring in um, just some wood, I think. I want, uh, what do we want? Fungi wood, that's what I want. That's dwarfy. Let's go do like... It's a lot of points. 50 of them? Probably too much. I'm going to spend all my points on this. We'll do 30 logs so we can get a few beds in here get just to get started. And I would like to get some armor. Um, at least get like one of my dwarves armored. I'm just kind of nervous. I don't know how tough it's going to be. I'm kind of nervous about how... Not nervous, but I'm, I'm worried about how... Um, how bad it's going to be out there. Because there's a lot of... It's this high savage world. So we'll just do some copper. Actually, I can probably afford a few of these. We can do copper. Two copper shirts. Copper's nothing too fancy. But, you know, it's... It's something. We can get maybe some uh, some copper hats. Two of those. And um, copper legs. I can make wooden shields. And I think I'm happy with that. Is that that seem like a good a good amount? We got 300, 300 points to spend. What should we buy? Yeah, new version. I like the new version quite a bit. You know, if I do this, I could I could afford like a another animal. If I wanted to get one of these one of these these um in the desert. Is there anything for them to eat in the desert? Who's that? Uh Zidane, thank you for the thank you for the gift sub. We could get something really cool. Um, we can gear one of our guys out with something nice, like a, um, an iron axe. Which isn't that cool, but it's better than nothing. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that we like that we need. That I'm missing. I don't think so. Let's just bring a little bit extra ale. We'll bring a little extra 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 liver, just to kind of get a little bit of a, a head start here. And I'll bring some more bags. Bags are always good to have around. Some extra thread. And, uh, um, three quivers is enough. Maybe some more seeds. We got, there's 46 dwarves in the world. They're not completely extinct. They're as extinct as you can get, because if they're all the way gone, then I think, I don't think you can, well, it used to be you couldn't embark on zero dwarf world. 
I'll take an extra copper shirt. I can get an extra pick. I'll take an extra pick. All right. There we go. Um, who are we called? Our fortress name is called Meyer Portals. No, no, we want something like, like um, Redemption something or uh, um, we're coming back. Um, granite Wad. <laughs> Not that one. Cloister Sank. Craft Justice. Craft Justice. That's good. That's good. Craft Justice. What's our group name? We're called the Ceiling of Slipping? No, no, no. We are the, sa <laughs> the Scaly Sacks. No, no. Um, The Mine of Channels. That's good. That's good. The Mine of... The Mine of Souls. There we go. All right. <laughs> they have cream for that. All right, welcome to the desert. Okay. My plan is to have a pyramid. <laughs> hey, Mashlet, how's it going? Steam says I'm away. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have it set that way. Otherwise, people talk to me. You have arrived after a journey from the mountain homes into forbidding wilderness beyond. Your harsh trek has finally ended. Your party of seven is to make an outpost for the glory of Orstistushir. Almost no supplies left, but with stout labor comes sustenance. Whether by bolt plow or hook provide for your dwarves, you're expecting a supply caravan just before winter entombs you. But it's spring now, enough time to delve secure lodgings. Air the cougars, get hungry. New place, uh, new chapter of dwarven history begins here at this place. Rigothimketh. Craft justice. Strike the earth. Kind of hurt myself there. All right. So this is our giant embark here. There is... There is... Cactus. There is a oh a saguaro. Uh, what do we got? We got like five trees here, six trees. Was that a um, old Toby? Thank you for the uh, the resub. Oh, thank you for the sub. I'm sorry. Thank you for the the sub. I certainly appreciate that. That. Um, you know, that black sand. Exciting. So we're not gonna do a um, we're not gonna do a a glass pyramid. We did glass last time, but we'll do a pyramid of some kind. So let's go and do a little uh, dig down. Like here in the center of the map, somewhere like that, and go down. We do have an aquifer here, so we probably should go find that and kind of figure that out at first. Um, I'm going to set a second dwarf to go do some mining things, which I'll probably give. We'll give uh, Locum over here. Uh, let me go get my, my dwarves named. I'm going to go down the list here. All right. Oasis is good. Let me pause because I'm going to hit an aquifer and just so they don't uh, mess that up. All right, Oasis, good, good, good. On theme, I like it, I like it. Who else we got? We have a, <laughs> okay. Not as not as on theme, but close, but close. I like it. <laughs> spicy Nugget. I hope I see Spicy Nugget again when we build another fortress. Glass Jaw, excellent, excellent. Okay, S uh, sand themed, we're going for here. Ploppy, Ploppy's good. All right, all right. Floppy, spicy nugget, oasis. Perfect. Hey, trash bird, how's it going? It's all sand down here, isn't it? Oh, man, it's coarse. It gets everywhere. There's limestone there. See how far down we can go before we hit that oasis, uh, um, aquifer. Dusty, dusty. There's a, uh, there's a, there's a, 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 a point thing. You can use to, it helps it helps put it in a list for me so I can see a little better. We got limestone down here. We'll go down just a little ways. We don't have to go all the way down, but we'll go down a bit. I was expecting to see a, an aquifer like right here, but not quite there. It's just a it's just a sand biome. Uh, so I I tried naming the cats before, but none of the cats ever uh it, the names don't stick when you pick cats, sadly. Okay, so let's go down to the bottom here and kind of carve this out a bit. Click the right thing. Get some basic things set up. We've got a. We can go get some some sand. Uh, um, what's the word? Farming, farming done here. And we'll set up like our. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. 
We'll put our steel and all that stuff down below. But we'll go get that mined out for for farming to get that set in there. Get some limestone. We got more. Mirage. I like it. Mirage. Mira Mirage. And what's the last one here? Locum is... I can give you... Uh, I'll give you a dwarf. Got Gatino? Gatino the cat dwarf. All right. Um... Unless it's, it may, there may have been a change that fixes that, but when I played before, it was, um, I named the cats, but they didn't stick. Uh, where's my other miner at? You have an axe in hand. How about, how come, how about you, uh, hmm, how about, how about Dusty go do it? I know I got more picks around. Go get a pick. Thank you. Jelly opal. What is that? Hmm. You just now see that? That's strange. Um, mine, mine that out. Why don't you? Okay, I like that black sand. That's cool looking. If I, I, um, you can't make like a black. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not building black sand glass, a glass tower. I, I even though I want to, I'm, I'm gonna resist. I'm gonna make it out of stone, probably limestone or something. Whatever we've got. We've got a farm plot there of, uh, of plump helmets. I may just do one of pigtails. It does seem like there's grass out here, though, so my, my animals would be fine. So we'll pin pasture, like, right here. And we'll just do a pyramid, and we'll just slowly kind of come in each time and build it to a point. Um, trying to be somewhat defensive, because I don't want to die. Plant some plump helmets. Do not forget. I always forget to not cook the plump helmets. And those are gonna go. Those are gonna go down here, and from here we'll go. Like I don't. I want to, most of the fortress is gonna be above. In fact, we can go ahead and do that right now. Let's go ahead and set things up up here. Um. We'll go ahead and set up my still. I'm trying to think what I want to do. There we go. Go like that. To get that working, we'll go ahead and set up the. Uh, we'll go ahead and get the kitchen out of the way and put it there. That'll be our food production spot. Uh, when we get this limestone done, which I maybe I just need to just start just start digging. Just let's just start getting some limestone brought in. There you go. That'll bring a bunch of it in. We'll get a wheelbarrow and bring it on up here, and we actually go ahead and set up a stockpile up up here. Make that uh, a stone stockpile. So they'll bring that limestone up here so we can get to work on this thing. So let's go ahead and put in some walls. And I don't know how big we're going to make this thing. I think I don't want to go too big. Because as big as I, the bigger I go, the the, big, the longer it's going to take to get to the top. This is how much. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Is that big enough? Um, I don't want to use my wood for this. If they do, I'll have to redo it. Is that too small? That's a pretty tiny pyramid. Pyramid. I think it's fine. Go down here, and we'll go ahead and set up a just a kind of a stockpile of everything, just to get everything brought in, so we don't get stolen. Oh yeah, I make a pyramid, then I make a sphinx. That's a good idea. This is going to be everything. We'll throw everything in there. Oh, using the wood, aren't they? Yeah, I should have should known they were going to do that. Maybe go a little bigger. Okay, so let's go get... So that's 12. We'll go to like... That'll put 15. Uh, 
18. Um, I should, as in, in, in the interest of making this run smoother, um, I should get a stone worker because I can turn all this stuff into into blocks. Because that would help. That would help a lot. I have too many puppies. What do I do? I think you. Uh, I think you know what you need to do. I don't want to say it, because then, you know, people get kind of upset. But I think you know. Uh, yeah, yeah, ma yeah, ma'am's got the idea. Okay, blocks. Okay, so all this stuff should get made in there, thrown in there, we get some blocks. Our uh, limestone will go a lot further if we do that. In fact, I'm going to tell them to stop doing this real quick, because I want them to make the most of that limestone. You know what I have to do? I don't have strength to do it. Yeah, I, I took down so many kitties last time, it, it kind of hurt a little bit. Okay, blocks. Okay, get to work, Mason. Alright, so you're gonna go and brew drink from plants. I'm gonna go ahead and set up a work order. We don't have a manager yet, so we should get that set that up also. And go there. We want uh we've got one person who's kinda does everything, which I think is spicy nuggets, so spicy nuggets is my administrator. Um we want him to have an office that'll work faster. A lot faster. I turn kitties in the paper so they can live on forever. Oh man, you monster. And you sleep at night. Alright, so this is one, two, this is eight, 18, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I have installed a couple mods. The mods are uh, the alert noise things. Um, I forget what the other ones are. Noise alerts. And how do I see them? I keep on forgetting to add them in. But I don't know actually how to see them. Um, I don't know. I'll tell you what they are, but I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember what they are. It's the one of the noise making one. Um, I don't remember what the other ones are. Sorry. Okay. Um, we're a little short there. We'll wait. Yeah, audible alerts is is one of them. Um, I don't remember. What was the other one? I, I, yeah, I don't know. They're the popular ones. Smoothing, yeah, yeah, smoothing mods. Yeah, yeah, this one. So we, we, how does it look? Um, let's sand. We can't do that one. Let's, let's smooth this wall right here. Oh, yeah, look at that. Much better, much better. Yeah, yeah. Rounded corners, I don't know that one. This will be a lot quicker, I think, than um, the last one because it... Um, the last one we were dealing with glass. And getting that, we had to go. We had to get all the stuff set up, like the 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 smelter and everything set up, or the glass smelter, to get the forge going to make those glass blocks. This one's all right here, you know. We're gonna be a white pyramid in the, in a black sandy beach or black sandy desert. I did. I did remember. I'm pretty sure I remembered. I'm pretty sure I did. I made like a whole bunch of worlds, so I assume I remembered them. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I might be able to see it on the world map. 
I do want to also want to turn this up just a little bit. I'm not going to go crazy with the speed, but I would like to go just a little bit, like like 150, you know, just just enough to like make a sweat a little bit. Yeah, I don't know. So there's my two people. There's 40 people there, and there must be six at that place. We are allied apparently with the humans over here, but we are at war with the tower. Some of you get attacked by undead things over here. Uh, these humans are massive. They are. It's all one big human alliance. Okay. Um, it said humans war, but it was this this thing. Oh, I was gonna show you. There was a there's a book called. Oh, what's it called? It was something with 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 a. One of the towers. Something like, uh, never expect the tower or something like that. That was great. I found a pink forest called the Forest of Love. Nice. Okay, let's go make some more. This one we're going to put in our bridge, which is going to be... If this is 18, what's going to be the center of this? All right, we'll do five. We'll just do it nice and easy. Five. So we can do a bridge of four right there, and that would be that would be centered. Okay, we'll go ahead and make it. Uh, you, 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 you don't need mis mechanisms until you. Do you need more already? I forget. I think maybe you do. Oh, maybe not. Just need mechanisms to raise it. Hey, Anverpia, how's it going? Porcupine is fighting a dog. Oh, man, he's going to come back with like spikes all in his nose. Oh, man, come on, buddy. Um, all right, let me go ahead and just get this work order set up. So we're going to go and brew. Drink from plants and set this one up at... I'm just going to set it at 100. And then we'll mark this thing down as... Like, check it. When it gets to 50, that's whenever you can come in and make some more. So we'll have about 150 at most. 50 to 150. Um, I would like the meals as well. We'll do a f some fine meals. I don't know. I think it's just takes. Is it just more time, or is it more ingredients for the better meals? I don't remember what the difference is. I feel like I probably should know that, but I don't know. Right, add that one, and we'll do. I think fifty. Is it more ingredients for the other ones? Okay. Okay. And then we need to get a carpenter in here um, to get some. Well, yeah, I guess beds. And we'll set that one up. We're going to probably have to do some rearranging here. We'll put our carpenter in. These are kind of lined up like there. Is that how we want this? The stairs aren't very centered, are they? Let's get one we'll movement in a minute. Oh, I wasted one of my, my logs for that. Oops. Okay, so you're going to make some beds, buddy. Go ahead and make ten beds and make... Um, I can make the barrels out of stone. Which is probably a better idea. They are called... What are they called? Co uh, what are they called as a, as a... Stone. Stone. A coffer is not... A coffer is like a... It's not a coffer, is it? Just make them out of, out of wood. There you go. Coffer's a chest. Okay, okay. What am I thinking of then? I'm thinking of... Um, I don't know. I don't know. So, I'm going to go ahead and get... We'll go ahead and make the ramps. Um, it won't be the safest thing if we put ramps in here first, I suppose. Look at that porcupine right there. Um, we already have a military, a capable military, so let's go and get our, our commander in here. A pot. I'm thinking of a pot. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. Um, I th got... My guys that are skilled in fighting. 
really anyone can do this job. We'll give it to not Glass Jaw, Spicy Nugget, or Oasis. So the, the, we'll do the top couple. So Gatino can be my, my commander. Metal Armor. We'll get there. We've got a bunch of stuff already. I'm going to make sure we add in the folks that know how to fight. Which Ploppy knows how to fight. And Mirage knows how to fight. And Miner knows how to fight. Uh, Dusty. Put them in there. They're not going to train right now because they know how to fight already. They'll just get some gear. And claim some gear, basically. And then when they when we need them, they can, they can do some killing. And I'm going to make... Let's make one ramp. Or two or so. I'll work our way up. Okay, so then we can get up to this wall here. And we should be able to... Let's see if this works, like I think it will. Still build a wall. Oops, I gotta go up one. I think we just get... I just get more clicks. Rock pot. <clears throat> I have autosave set up in every season. Just a just a dwarf fortress thing, you know. We only go up, and we should be able to go build walls. I think we can build them here. In the olden days, we could. Yeah. And then we'll just we'll just ramp that as well, and we'll slowly work our way up. It's gonna be a step period at the moment. Step pyramid. A lot of rats down there. I'm really glad the cats are happy. go and like this is all limestone also let's just mine this one out also we don't need to worry about um like digging out down there because we're gonna be doing everything up t upstairs here and porcupine turn up my poor dog um seeds are working right yep seeds are happening uh let's go ahead and get I'd like to have like a manager office or something. We can dig that out real quick down here. We'll just set up a uh, like a like an aisle. We'll put in, put in his office here. We can have I think it's just one guy though. One guy that has a manager office stuff. So while you're here, make me a um, make me a table and make me a throne. We'll give him a spot. What do we got? Bed complete. I don't know. I like that alert sound because I'm used to it being other things. Okay, drinks are looking good. We are out of of food spots. And we don't have a place to put our food, so we should probably do that. We don't have a place to eat. Um, I'll set that up just down here real quick also. Like we need some sort of a meeting area and stockpile and all that stuff. There's like, what, six trees out there? So we got a few trees hanging around. <laughs> From top to bottom. Hey, migrants have arrived. That's not the sound of migrants, that's the sound of a wedding. I'm not sure how I feel about these uh this this mod. Green Tower went well. One of, my, one of my better, one of my better fortresses. Um, everything, everything went 
very smoothly with that fortress. Still standing, standing strong. We fought off a dragon. All went well. I'm not sure. Um, we're gonna find out if we need support. Support things. How's our dig going? Oh, we're busy doing that instead. Now, where are our diggers? Oh, they're digging that out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you get this first real quick? I would like this done first. Please. What do we got? Um, already? The Silvery Communion. We might have some weird things this time because we've got so few people in our empire that we might get a lot of strange uh, pop-ups like this early on. Silvery Communion wants to have a temple here. I approve. I would love to make this uh, a temple. Okay, so I want to go and mine this out. And I'm going to make... That's going to be a stockpile spot for food and drinks. We'll adjust it here in seconds. So I want this one to be no drinks. Oops. I used to get those backwards. None of those and none of those. So food on that side, and then this one is going to be only drinks. There we go. Drinks over there, food over there. A dwarven pyramid. That's right. Uh, okay, so this is going to be meeting area. Right there. A nice sandy meeting area. Man, these dwarves are going to hate this. Uh, uh, inn and tavern. And dining room. Okay. Okay, we'll fit that out. That's going to be my, my, uh, my, my, uh, my manager spot. I'm kind of worried now that that tower is right there. I think we're going to have some problems. Uh, oh, yeah, my animals. Did I not pasture them? I'll put my chickens out here for now. Okay. Okay, that one's done. Take a little bit to get to this, this stuff in the center. Um, actually, I can get a ramp across here and it'll be all right. I think I'll probably do it now. Can I do that now? I think I can. Then it'll let me get those blocks in there. Okay, so now more blocks. Give me the fastest pyramid ever. Get this thing all enclosed before we get attacked. Um, I'd like to have... It'd be nice to have some spot right in here somewhere. We can we can shoot out. Or maybe we build up, like, obelisks outside that we can put our archers in to shoot out. Limestone is authentic. I'm, I'm, I'm glad you're, the pyramids are built of limestone, aren't they? Like the, the pyramids? I'll come in here later and get these ramps done. <laughs> I didn't. That's great. It's a map full of sand. Cats are installing mines all over the place. <laughs> oh, a glass cap. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. What we'll do is we'll have a center, like, stairwell here. Um, 
perfect. We can probably go ahead and start it now, just so I get it placed right. So one, two, three. This is this is a um, there's a gap here of sixteen, right? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's the center. We don't really have a good center, but we can do like um, is that the center? We don't really have a good center. I could do something like that as a center. But then we um, we cancel the ones in the middle. I was the wrong one. Like that. Or like a big giant stairwell that goes kind of kind of the, to the top. In the center here, we put our pedestals and our, um, you know, whatever we, valuable stuff we've got. And then it keeps on going up to the, to the top. That's not centered, is it? It's not centered. I'm crooked. I need to go one. I do need to go one over. Is that too big of a stairway? That's going to be like take up all my space if we do like that. So maybe we should just do a center one. As cool as it looks. Let's replan that. My stairs fell down. I don't like I don't like the sound effects. <laughs> I want to turn that off. Um You guys okay? Did you get not oh yeah, they got everyone's okay, right? No one's dead. There's a little bit of a crisis there. Or it keeps, it's going to keep falling as long as I do this. I need to, I need to cancel the ones on top before we do the ones at the bottom. Um, cancel those orders. Okay. Get rid of the ones on top, and then you can come back down and, and do that stuff. <clears throat> I was told uh, that if I look through my telescope over the ocean uh, uh, this morning, this morning, look over the ocean, there, there would be a, a, an outline of a black hole. Did you hear this? Well, I tried. I didn't see anything. Uh, you could say it was an uneventful horizon. Okay, so top up's been been removed. We need to remove the bottom now. There we go. Okay. Um, I want that one right there. Someone's, there's a bard visiting us. Okay. Um, I'm going to tell you, you're making a lot of blocks. You're doing a good job. But can you go and make me a couple of chairs and things first? Make me some... Make me like a few... I don't need ten of them. Make me like six... And six thrones. Ten's probably fine. But just, yeah, get that. And I'm going to make... Um, I'm going to expand this stockpile. Here we go. That staircase is just in the wrong spot. <laughs> okay, blocks go there. Stairs and uh, uh, chairs and tables and all that kind of stuff are gonna go uh, down below into our, into here. We have an office space now. Fantastic movie for our manager, Spicy Nugget here, who also will keep the books. Though he's my bookkeeper too, right? Do I have him set up? Spicy Nugget, you're my bookkeeper also, buddy. Go do all kinds of things. You you can broker as well. Letas is actually the better one. Oh, we do it, dwarves. We got dwarves. That's right. It was the wedding sound. Okay. I do have a Dr. Dwarf. We're going to bring glass, glass jaw in here for Dr. Dwarf. Okay, I have more dwarves available if you want to be a dwarf. Uh, just give me some names here, please. One throne. Excellent. Do I have any tables? joke had astronomical levels of dadness. 
become the resident DF expert in my friend's Discord, despite being the only person who started playing with the Steamverse. Nice. Nice. All right. Okay, let's um, let's let's cap the thing, and then we'll worry about the stairs inside. Got a ramp. Anyone's got a ramp? We need a ramp right there. Lots of blocks have been made, so we'll get finished on that. It's gonna be really cool whenever we get the the ramps in there, and they all line up right. Okay, we're getting there. We're sand dwarves, the dwarves of the of the of the desert. So each level can be something. We can just leave it open because that's kind of neat. We build underneath. We just this just big a big open area. We don't actually put anything in here. There is supposed to be a uh, an aquifer here, and I'd like to find it because I would like some water. Uh, blocks are so I did that tutorial series, and I I I feel like three of those those episodes I meant I had on my list to talk about blocks, and I forgot each time. And I didn't go back in and until after it was posted. I was like, oh yeah, I forgot about blocks. Um, blocks, you get like four blocks for every rock. And so blocks are much more uh, economical at, uh, at building. So if you're going to build something like this, use blocks. This way, my my, uh, my limestone can go a lot further by doing it this way. Okay, we'll ramp up right there. How's my uh, how's my tavern looking? A lot of rocks in there. So making the oh you're making those yeah you're making blocks again and taking your time with thrones as well. Seeds are okay. Oh well not okay, but they will be okay once we get drink problems fixed or once we get drinks made. Let me go get some chairs. Let me go. There's some plump helmets coming in right now. Okay, quite a dining room. You have your spots. Uh, we are we got good numbers now. We got one cranky dwarf. Who's cranky? My um, Mirage the Carpenter, because we only brought so much wood, and they'll just they're mad because there's only like um, cactus out there. Yeah, that's good. Okay, going up. Uh, one more. Uh, I didn't build a trade depot. I knew I was forgetting something. Uh, the dwarves have arrived. Uh, we need a trade, trade depot real quick. Let me build one of those. I knew I was forgetting something. I uh, will cram it over here. It's fine. As long as we get a three wide space, they can bring big wagons in, which they probably don't have that anyway. Okay. Here they come. They got some donkeys. They won't settle yet until we give them a spot here. Which we're working on. Seems like I don't know if it's it's um I don't know. It seems like dwarves are more responsive with the Steam version. Like this is the times I would build the the um, trade depot, and you know I feel like it would take forever for them someone to get there and just build the dang thing. But every time I make something now, it it's like immediately made. Like they're listening to me. I haven't done anything I can sell yet. Um, I really want to though. I want to make some money. I want to make an impression with these dwarves. So I'm gonna throw in a craft guy. I'm gonna put them right in here, just just to get them somewhere. 
Um, this is here's Neil talk, chatting with us. World's the same as ever. Really? Nothing? No news? Okay. No news. We got us settling over here. Um, oh, Godin was, was kidnapped over there. Became first earth of the silvery communion. Oh, yeah, my temple. Yeah, we're building the temple over here. I forget. I should probably build that temple. Um, I would like you to just go take a bunch of... I think we're going to take rocks. And... What are we going to crank out real quick to sell? Make some rock... Rock scepters. Make a whole bunch. And do it now. And I'm going to have you dump them all right here. We're going to take them up to... The, make as many as you can. We're going to throw them upstairs to sell. Uh, they go into finished goods. I wonder how many changes from the Steam version will make it way to the classic version. I think, like, pretty much everything's supposed to be going going over there. I think. I'm not sure when the classic is supposed to be getting updated. I think it's supposed to be reasonably um, soon. My poor dwarves don't have any bedrooms. They've been here for like a long time. They don't have any bedrooms. I'm starting to feel a little bad. We have a dancer visiting us. Look at them scepters. Yeah, looking nice. Looking real nice. Make me one more and we can sell that thing. So we're going to bring in, um, where do they show up at? Scepters. 30 bucks. Yeah. That'll work. Um, I don't have a lot of food around. It's usually a good, a good seller at the beginning. I don't have any gems. Oh yeah, I got a few rough gems. All worth, uh, those rough jelly opals are worth something though. Should cut those things. Let me just do a little bit. Like we'll find more. Do that. You want my table? No. Okay. Just throw that stuff up there. Yeah, I know the temple. Uh, maybe I should just throw the. I was gonna put bedrooms in here. Maybe I should just throw the temple in here because they're gonna be real cranky if I don't give it to them. And I want to, I want to, I want to make sure I don't make anyone mad. So this is a temple. To do we remember who it was? It was one of these, the Silvery Communion. Okay, it needs to be better. So we're gonna make it. We have to make it nice. Um, which actually is gonna be kind of difficult with with uh, sand. But they got something there. Okay, get the broker over there. Let's chat with these guys. And I'm gonna give you everything, and and we'll see what I can get out of you. Out of you. That's what. That's what. Thirteen hundred bucks. Well, uh, I would like a uh, ooh, a red log. That's pretty fancy. Um, like an instrument would be nice. Something we can like place. For, with some value. Warhammer. Hmm. I always question buying some of those. We have steel anvils in this place. Nice. You don't have any anything of, of excitement. Well, uh, then give me that give me that instrument. What do you say? It's like a deal. 
pleased with the trading. Good. Come back next year and be happy. Uh, let's put that instrument right in here. Uh, what is instrument listed? Furniture? Yeah. What, what, what a temple it is now. Value of 35. And it's now value is 1,000. Okay. Okay. Uh, we can put in, like, flooring and stuff to make it a little nicer. Well, I can't because that thing's there now. Um, I got a lot of jet. Let's do a black floor. I don't have enough jet. Okay, it'll be like that. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. I, that is a good idea. I always forget about that. Grabbing, like, gypsum or something for the hospital. That is a really good idea. I don't think I found anything. Yet. Let's see if we can find that aquifer. If anyone wants to dig. What are they digging at right now? Where are my diggers at? Okay, we want to go one more. <clears throat> Almost there. We'll go, actually, we'll probably do just one more, and that's it. Because the last one's going to be glass. Which I could buy, could buy from them. So I'm only buying four pieces of glass. I should buy that from them. Are they still here? They are. Do you have any glass? You do have, you have two glass, which isn't going to give me enough. I need like three, I think. Well, no. I don't know what we need, but we don't we need more than that. I would like to have, like, done glass, like a glass block. It'll get me a lot further. It's kind of a cool thing, though, whenever we... Look at that. Look at that effect. Neat. Okay, how's the uh, how's the temp temple looking now? Uh, still a thousand. We need to engrave it. No one's really good at engraving, but we'll, we'll do that. We can carve it out and put better walls in. That is anyone digging yet? Where's my miners at? What are you doing? Where do I have you mining instead? Why are you doing that? Not down here. What did I do wrong down here? Look, buddy. Why are they going? Why are they going down? It's downstairs. Why aren't they? Why aren't they digging that? <laughs> Dig that out. I'll dig that one, huh? All right. That's weird. Where's this aquifer at? Kind of hoping for an aquifer because it's nice to have water around. Dolomite, that's a, is that a, um, a plaster thing? Mudstone. All right. Oh, oh, those those scepters. Uh, yeah, you can stop that now. Um, next time they come, though, we got a bunch of scepters for them and some jet scepters as well. Okay, I do want to go ahead and get this wall done. Migrants have arrived, and we'll make these out of limestone. A 
see a couple migrants in there. Okay, and then we can engrave those walls. How many we get? Well, yeah, we got a, quite a quite a herd here. We've got twenty dwarves. There's only so many in our fortress. I'm, I think the first two are like set. You get your first two ways, but then after that, you get nothing. So um, I'm gonna guess we're gonna get no more migrants after this. I think these twenty are gonna be pretty much it. So let's go get some names in here. Throw out some names for me. We've got uh, we got uh, San Sandy, and um, we're gonna have. Um, uh, um, Crystal, give me some sand words. We want, uh, what's a good, um, um, <laughs> clip clop. Okay. Okay. I like it. Um, I don't know if you, uh, oh uh, yeah. Silica. That's a good one. That's a good one. Um, is that like shiny? Shiny? Shiny. Grit. Excellent. Windy. I like it. It's a lot easier for me if you uh, if you use the points. I, I was gonna make them cheaper and I for, I forgot. Um. Loam. Good word. Good name for a dwarf too. Um. Grit. Shiny. Gets. <laughs> get, get. Especially with a beard like that. Okay. We got uh, Sunny. Yeah, I got, I got, uh, I got three more here. Oh yeah, brick. Sanson. And one more. Uh, what's a good one here? Oh, nice. Nice is pretty good. Uh, silver, I like. We have dusty already. Ruby, dune. Dune is a good one. Dune Miller. Made friends with Gilu. All right. So we got our 20 dwarves. I hope to make this into um, a mountain home. That's what I'm going for. Now, I do want to make sure we get some doors made also. Get out of the way, you dang llama. <laughs> hey, LaPost, thanks for the sub. Thank you very much. Okay, let's set those guys over there. Okay, so we've got that done. I wonder if I should, like, cap it, though, just in case. I don't want to get attacked. Because things can just walk up here and cause all kinds of problems. Especially if I make that. I could always put my uh, my walls up here and then um, redo redo it later on. We're getting attacked by a honey badger. He killed my duck. How dare he! So we're just gonna wall it for right now, cap it, but then we'll change that out with some glass later on. But now we're 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 sealed in now. As soon as we get that bridge done. Um, with the mechanic shop and all that. So let's go get the, um, mechanic set up. And... I think that's all we need right now. A jeweler. I'm gonna go ahead and get a jeweler in here. Okay, so the mechanic make me some, some mechanisms. And if we have, I think we have a table laying over. Make me a make me a traction bench. Craft guy, you're busy doing nothing. Um, jeweler guy, you just cut some gems. Gems to cut. We'll set those out. How did I find this game? I found it originally um, from Quill Eighteen, um, a long time ago. And um, for the longest time, I just watched Quill play it. I didn't really. Um, have much intention of playing it. I, I tried playing it the first time, and I had no idea what was going on, so I didn't. Uh, I kind of gave up. I think I tried. I tried a couple times, 
But I always just kind of gave up. I got to the, like, the embark screen, and I was like, ah, you know what? Um, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> so, let's play something else. Um, but I finally just kind of, kind of stuck with it. And kind of forced my way through uh, learning it. And watched a bunch of Daz Tactic tutorials. And uh, that was seven years ago or so. <clears throat> also, man, uh, mammals. Thank you for the sub. I think I missed you there. A lever to be. I'll put it right here by the door. And we'll connect it up to this guy. Link it to uh, the bridge, and we'll try it out. In a minute. Well, uh, right now my animals are staying in this area down here. I don't mind that being like animal land. That's actually not a bad idea. We can we can always build the stairs and then go up uh, and have another little platform up there. Pull the lever, see what happens. Something smelly in here. Wink. Hey, it works. What's what's smelling in here? I don't see anything dead. Oh, there's something dead. Oh, there's a honey badger. Uh, we gotta dump this guy. Let's just set this up as like a um um a nice. I probably want to get away out of my fortress. So uh, we're gonna dig a channel. And throw it, like, here. Channel that out. And we'll just make that our garbage dunk. Dump. You stuck in there? Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Someone will get you out there in no time. Don't you worry. There you go, buddy. Come on out. You can come out now. Why is it not coming out? Can you, uh, you can make it out of there, right? Are you stuck in there? <laughs> He's sleeping. Once he wakes up, he'll get out. Come on, Dusty. Human merchant is visiting us. Okay. Uh, this thing is smelly. We gotta get this thing out of here. Uh, there we go. He's out of here now. Okay, so let's go set up my garbage dump, which is gonna be like this. We're just gonna go like that. And we should go and start tossing stuff in there. I have to go take a bathroom break. So I'm going to do that. When I come back, we'll um, start working our way up. And start getting... Try to get everything in the tower. Or in... Sorry. In the pyramid. And well, we'll see where we go from there. I'll be right back. Give me just a minute.
Alright. I'm trying to decide what I want to do with um, like my bedrooms. I want, like I don't want to do what I do with my tower and have like way too few bedrooms. It'd be kind of cool to have it in in the um, in the pyramid. However, unless we did something like like, like matchstick bedrooms, we really wouldn't, wouldn't be able to do much. Like, I could do it here, but how many can I get in there? Like, one, two, three, four. I could get, like, f five. I could get five bedrooms there. So we could have... Like, we could have a decent amount of bedrooms, actually, in this, this room. If we were to make this the bedroom area, we could put the barracks right here so we could shoot out over the bridge. Um, yeah, you know, that might work, actually. So I'm going to set up my, my stair. Let's go ahead and work our way up. I think this is the center right here. Well, we can see it easier this way. So these four squares are the center. So we'll do a four stairway. All the way, all the way to the top. Why not? Jet blocks are cool, but we'll stick them with we'll stick with limestone. And from there, we'll build our floors out. Also, um, I, uh, I want to do something with my military real quick. I've got, what, two people in the military right now? Four. Um, I want to make sure they're equipped right, because they, oh, uh, yeah, get your metal armor. I know we've got metal armor around here. We brought it. Put your metal armor on. I know I brought you metal armor. Is it maybe not in a stockpile, which is why we're not doing it? Could be. Okay. Uh, well, we're going to do it this way. The 84. Okay. Let's do this then. This will probably be the barracks right there. So we'll set up a barracks. Did I do walls? Oops. Like that. And... But that is a barracks. Um, and then make a stockpile. Tactical reason for the pyramid? Nope. <sighs> Just, um... This is how we rebuild our, uh, our, our civilization. All 46 of us. Hey, booze boss man. Thanks for the resub. More drinks than food. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. That is probably an issue. Um, we probably can start. If we need, we can start farming cats or whatever. Um, actually, I'm going to go ahead and get this set before um, I forget about it. Okay, wait, wait, wait just a second. But I'm going to come over here and make my butcher in the corner. And I'm going to go ahead and slaughter a cat. I'm going to make sure that we don't use the soap. So we set up cat soap as our our, our, our soap of choice. So I'm going to go ahead and tell them right now. I think we have some kittens. No, we don't yet. Mm, we'll hold off then. I'm going to make... I think this is going to be like outside area. Like the first layer of the pyramid will maybe have like the... Like a kind of a good entryway here. But everything else around here, I think it's going to be like farming and butcher and all that kind of stuff. I think that's what I want to do. We'll move these these out of the way in a minute. Um, so we'll set up like a, a, a chicken coop kind of area. So I would like uh, a couple nest boxes. We'll make them out of rock. Rock and nest boxes. Like that. So we'll have, yeah, we'll, we'll like pave this real nice. And we'll put in maybe like a wall or something. We do need a way to get to here. We could actually put the depot right, right there. So as you come in, you're right there. And then all this area around here will be farm. Uh, not farm, but you know, like animal spots and, and butcher spots and that kind of stuff. Our nest boxes can be kind of stashed away in the corner. Something like that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and mark this as a barracks right up here. And
and we mark that as their barracks. I'll let them sleep up there too. We'll put some beds in there. And we'll probably have black walls or something. We'll mark this off. Wall will be right there, I think. No, there. I don't know. That way they've got a spot they can hang out. Um, I would go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and put in the fortification. Fortification. So we want. We want to. We want to cut these in here. Uh, this gaps right there. So we'll get some bows. We can shoot through there. We don't have any bows yet, but we will eventually. It's only one level up, so we can shoot down. And I think if I put in, I'm gonna just, just stick a stockpile like that for right now of of weapons. And we'll do the same thing over here with uh, with an armor stockpile. I'll move this later. But I know I brought all this stuff. I'm guessing it's just not in a pile anywhere. Here we go. Giant stockpile. Throw everything in there. Like black beds, cool. A bunch of statues done too. So let's go get those in here. Is that a what is that a picture of? I don't know, but it's something cool. That is what? Limestone of a cassowary man. Okay. This is a ram. Of a, a water buffalo. We have another water buffalo one. We That guy loves... Uh, what's his face? Loves water buffaloes. And an image of just a dwarf. That's all you got? Just a dwarf. Uh, who's my... Who's my crafter? My stone worker? I don't know. I'm not sure who it is. I wish we'd show the names in there. Yep. Birdman. Have you ever seen a cassowary? Those crazy birds. Crazy. Freaky. <laughs> okay. I gotta plan this out. And I'm going to put in... How can I do this? So, if we do... Um, I'm going to keep on flooring here. Have enough for that? I need 48. Nope. I think this is going to be, this is going to be bedroom... Bedroom land. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get my four my four square bedrooms. I'd like to. But if we did that, like for instance, if we did that, it would be oh, it does actually fit pretty good. Like that. We have to have a wall here, so we couldn't we'd have to have like two gaps. We couldn't put any bedrooms in here. Unless um, we did smaller ones. All the way there. We get the wall there. So we actually can't get anything. It's just going to be open area here. It can only go on the outside. Unless I did something a little different where I did like... What if we try doing... Three bedrooms? Like three wide? So you got doorway, bed, case. Bookcase. Like that. And then, so it would be a wall here, hallway, wall, and then we could do another. Well, we couldn't, because we got that wall there. I guess if we, yeah, I guess if we walled right here. And then, may, yeah, you know, maybe we could figure that out, because we have wall, hallway. Wall, wall. 
that's not going to be. It's going to be one over. Like that. So if I did this, wall, hallway, it could be like that. No, because it has a wall there. Hmm. I think that's just kind of a kind of a waste of. Well, no, because we can put a door right there. That's kind of a yeah. It's kind of a waste of space. Can always do the the matchstick bedroom, which is something like uh, like this. It's not not as glamorous, but you just do a. a Wall, you do a um, door. Actually, you just do a door right there and just have a bed. That's, that's not good, though. Door there. Bed. So it'll be a hallway right here. We got some extra space there. I don't know how to do this. Hmm. Get the floors out, and then we'll figure it out. more. Two by two against the bottom wall. Yeah. Two by two. No, because you need you need a wall around it, and you get a walkway. Like that. Remove the second row. So our hallway would be like this. That's going to be our hallway if we do these rooms. Whoops, like that. You get the idea. Um, I did that wrong. Could squeeze the barracks in, that might make a difference. All the way there. Or we just do. Oh, we'll figure it out when we get there. Well, oh, um, we'll figure out when we get to it. I'm tired of thinking about it. How's the value of this place? Uh, so it says 1,000. We have. Um, Wendy's my broker, but Wendy doesn't. Wendy, are you going to go look at that place and tell me it's nice? Pretty nice. Let's engrave those walls. Did we do that already? And get those wall walls engraved. Uh, Karud wants to live here to entertain. Karud? Sure. Make one hallway to left to right. So that's what I was thinking of originally, which is make the, the dwarves underground and the military up there. But the military can live... I'm going to remove these stockpiles. They can have beds on one side. It doesn't need to be a big spot. They can be in here. Or the military could be around the staircase. And that would solve our problem. So we, we, they would just be in this spot here. We'd have a little hallway here to get to the tower. Or to get to the archer spot. Um, that might work. So the, this is the barracks. With hallway that way. And then maybe a lot of around somehow. I don't know. Something like that. Uh, yeah, I'll take another entertainer. Do we have limestone coming up? Let's go get some more limestone dug out. We never found that aquifer, did we? I was hoping to find an aquifer. I don't have any water on this map. I said there was an aquifer. I think it's lying to me. I don't really want to break the caverns yet. Uh, I could put I could put the barracks anywhere, but I was gonna put it there because they only shoot one level down, and that way they can stand here. It'd be a, it'd be multiple multiple spots. We could they could stand there and shoot, and also have a barracks in the same spot, kind of save save um, space that way. All 
All right. Uh, that was gonna be my barracks. I was gonna do originally because I've got no, I no no place for anybody. Not barracks. Uh, dormitory. Just for uh, now. Did you three le three zeal? You say that, but uh, last time I, they didn't. I had them that it, it wouldn't go more than um, it didn't work. I, th I thought they could do three, th three Z levels as well, but it didn't, it didn't work. I mean, my archers were dumb. That's very possible. Yeah. Yeah, because I when I put my uh, my tower, I I assumed three, and uh, I thought I took that off. So that's auto save came on. But yeah, it didn't it didn't work. Or they just didn't want to shoot. Very possible. But I, th I th really kind of like the idea of doing the three. I never tried a bedroom system like that. So we'd have a wall just along this way, a door, hallway, wall, rooms, and then another wall there. And we could do doubles. I think I like that idea. I'm not sure if it would actually give me more bedrooms. We could even do... I think I want that. So we have open space, cabinet, bed. And then the corners can be... That won't work. Um, they'll have to be skinny as well. Not quite line up. And then, you know, like that... And that's, and then we have wall, hallway, wall, other room. Is that off? Oh, I didn't, I'm off, I'm off. It's supposed to be like this. I have to have a wall there. So this is going to be much of a barracks. And then we'll figure out a way of having, having a barracks in here. And we'll have just a hallway here for them to stand at. So we'll have a wall right there. Okay, I think that'll work. How do I remove these? Yeah, that's what, I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. Blueprint mode. Ah, who needs blueprints when you got green stuff? How are we doing now? Uh, I think my guy should go in there and tell. Uh, maybe um, see something. Oh yeah, brick. Go dance, buddy. Go dance in there. This needs to be a nicer room. I promised. I promised it'd be, it'd be nicer. Because you engrave, maybe? Why can't you? Well, we'll move that. Okay. Uh, let's see. Nest boxes. Let's go ahead and get them put in. How many bees out here? There'll be chicken land right over there. We'll go ahead and mark them as chicken land. Chicken run right there. There is an alert. Some chickens get over there and rooster. And uh, the, the, the peacock can go over there too. And the, the pea hen. And the pea chick. And a baby pea chick. 
What's this all about? Oh, the elves have arrived, huh? The elves have arrived. Elves have arrived. How do we feel about elves? I didn't think we knew the elves. Can a forest save the world is the artifact they have. Oh, those are goblins. No, it says no population over there of, of elves. Where are you guys from? Oh, there is elven forest. We're allied with the elves. Well, we got to fix that. We're allied with everyone. We got to fix that. We'll fix that before too long. Out of barrels. Uh, I think I unicorns, but I think they only they only haul stuff in with it. There's feather tree egg yolks laying there. Uh, do you guys like scepters? Because I got a lot of scepters. I got a lot of scepters. You want those? I got some gems too. You like gems? I'd rather save these. Ooh, I got a radiant cut jelly opal. I'd rather save those for my people. And not you. But you can have some of the garbage ones. There you go. May not have anything other than animals, though. Probably don't have anything. Elves never have anything good. Almost all my stars came with one enemy. Yeah, our one enemy is a necromancer. I'm a little concerned about that. And speaking of, do you guys ever get any uh, any gear? I know we have stuff. You got weapons. I brought stuff. Where is my... I brought copper stuff. Why aren't they using it? Metal headwear. I know we've got it. Did it get like, um, stolen? Nothing down here. I know I brought some copper stuff. Well, I guess we gotta dig. We gotta find some. Some metal to equip ourselves. Uh, what do you guys have? Anything worth taking? You have a camel and a turkey. Some swords. You have a cape. Some shields. You're not gonna be anything good. You're gonna be all wood. Some saguaro fruits. Um. Skirts. That's it? That's all you have? Enchanted by our more ethical works. Well, you know, I do what I can. I'm gonna take. I'll take your hat. I can't gear myself out with. I can take your. I can make shields. I'll take a couple of these. I don't want your camels. Elf made socks. Yeah, I think that. Uh, I don't have anything else that I that I care about. I might take um, their skirts, as well though. Loincloth, sign me up. Yeah. So you can have. What do you got? Some of these. I won't make them mad just yet. I would like to fight them, though, at some point. Um, oh, wait. I got the scepters for this whole purpose. There you go. Okay. I'd like to have those unicorns. Until we get more limestone. We're not going to get any more stuff done here. We're gonna have to dig down and find some uh, some bituminous or uh, something. We also need to find some iron. So maybe what we should do is start sending off some like offshoots. Oh, chalk! Nice, chalk is good stuff. That'll give us some some cast 
things for our doctor that we'll make one of these days. Next level, we could do like doctor, offices, um, sort of random things. I think I might keep my workshops kind of down below here. We can make this just like one big workshop hall around this way. We got like stockpile in the center, workshops along the edges. That'd be a bad idea. I've got this big cutout area down below. Someone left their pants on the ground. It's all chalk. Mine that out, and we'll mine out some of these. Let's do some exploratory mine in here. Looking for some hematite. Uh, I'll be happy with tetrahedrite. Something good. Do a little bit of care and see what we can what we can come up with. Yeah, we'll see what shows up here. I guess what that's what that's all. About. Oops. Oh, planter. Uh, gypsum, Chalcedonian, Chrysoprase. Okay, the elves, uh, the elves are leaving. It's on a floor. That's... Now, I'm going to go ahead and work on this. Bedroom time. So I'm going to have a wall there. Bedroom, we need a wall here. And then I'm going to come in. I'm going to tell them to not make... Oh, hang on. There's a door. Is that how I want it? Is it? Shouldn't it... Okay. Right? No. No. Wrong. Um... Get, I'll get this one of these days. So we want... We could do uh, a door. No, I want a door in the middle. So we'll we get we'll do that out of limestone. And then we're going to have another one there. Which I do this right. I'll do the first one right and then I'll get it. Out of the blocks. And then one there. Okay, like that. Doesn't seem like it lines up like I had it originally, does it? I guess I'll have a door there, which will go into this one, which will just be a big one. Oops. Okay, we'll see. We'll see how it is. Have the doors in the upper. Yeah, I think I think I did. Um, I like it this way better because doorway. So then like, each room you can have a bed and a and a and a, and a cabinet, bed cabinet, bed cabinet, bed cabinet. This might just be a big one. Also, how are we how are we doing on these these uh this mineral hunt? 
Um, Santa Claus. What nationality is Santa Claus? Any ideas? Well, he's North Polish, of course. <laughs> I'm sorry. Grit has taken a, by a fey mood. No migrants this season. We're probably not going to have any migrants for a while. I did gain two people, though. Oh, the people that came in and visited us. Uh, Grit, a jeweler. Claim them jeweler's workshop. Hopefully he can find the stuff that he wants. Uh, let's go and grab this stuff. I know, that one was that one was shameful, wasn't it? Wasn't my typical high quality dad jokes. Uh, hey, Tetrahedrite. I like this. I like that. that that'll that do something. You know, that's uh, that's good stuff. <clears throat> Construction begun. Tetrahedrite will give us. Uh, oh, we made a nice door, huh? Oh, you're gonna give me that door? Well, I appreciate that. It'll go in your bedroom. We discovered a cavern. Where? Oh, we hit it right there. Oh, okay. I wasn't expecting that. Wait, where did we hit it? Oh, we hit it over here. Oh. Well, we found the cavern. Anything else good in there? I just see tetrahedrites. Anything scary in there? There's a goblin poet and a rat woman poet in my fortress. Uh, okay. Are you in my fortress? Yeah, you are. You're just hanging around in the in in. Yeah, look at that. Those are big. Those are big camels. They are giant. How massive they are? Can I have those? We'd be eating good if we got those. So by doing this, it should get rid of the floors and then rebuild it with the walls. So it should make up some of my blocks we've got here. I say that, but apparently not. Yeah, I'm going to come in and try to steal my doors. I, I know. I know. I'd like it to be right there in, in this place. So let me, let me yank this door out. Put the new one in. Gremlin. In my fortress? Where? 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 Gremlin. There he is. Got a smile and everything. Go get him. Okay, you guys get your first your first bit of action. 444 years old. Where's he going? He left. He didn't steal anybody, did he? Anything? Get that door placed in here. Oh, yeah, we're hitting the caverns. But a floor fungus is going to come in and take over this place. We could put all our animals in here. Okay, so I want a door. I want the fancy door. The fanciest door we got, which is this one. Oleritas. I think this count. If it's built there, I'm assuming it counts as a construction that works for the for this. So we're going to find out. It still thinks it's at 1,000. There's another honey badger out there. Where is it? Is it still alive? There's a troll around here too. He's just hanging around. He's just hanging out downstairs, so he's fine. Do you count as a better value now? You do, much better. Okay, good. So we're now a temple. Uh good. The priesthood of the silver communion is ready to be recognized. I'd love to recognize them. Yeah, I recognize you. Okay. So we need a, hurly, a holy turquoise in this place. And I think Dune is going to be it. Comedian, you know? That's what we need in this place. Too much somber. People walking around complaining, whining about sand and getting everywhere. We need someone with a, with a, with a, with an, you know, the right attitude.
Okay, that'll make us look good in, in the eyes of our, our people. Uh, speaking of doors, I think I've got... A f I know I have a few, so let's make some more doors. And we want more walls... here. Out of limestone would be ideally. Not, not that. Oh, magnetite. Wait, where are we? I missed that. Short magnetite somewhere. Yep, spicy nugget's still here. No one's died yet. Where do we find that magnetite? I wish I hadn't. Oh, there it's right there. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, I declare this forge land then. For now. <laughs> yeah, yet, you know. We're gonna we're gonna lose a few. I guarantee. Okay, this game. Time flies when I play this game. I thought I would look, just look just look at the clock. I figured I would stream for what an hour? I mean, you're two hours so far. Okay, so, uh, look, we can get that, well, we can't do much with the furnaces, because we don't have any uh, coal or anything, but we can get a couple things started. A wood furnace isn't going to do as much good. There's not a lot of wood out there. I guess we need one. Unless we find some magma nearby. There wasn't magma down in those caves, was there? What's that? Sphalerite. It's easier to see this way, I think, because you can see the... No magma. There's an ulm. Did you yellow stuff? Brimstone. I didn't find any coal down here either, did I? Morion. Like bituminous. There's a lot of tetrahedrite. Or limonite be nice to have. More magnetites. Where? There? There. I never yeah, I never found the aquifer. It's possible it's like um like that's what this this here is. Like it's maybe I don't know. Up this way. Yeah, we never found it. That's a that's a ton of Magnetite. There was one little seam of magnetite and it opened up all this. Wow. Okay. Look at magnetite. Keep an eye on those things. Uh, all right. Well, we'll get we'll get them built here. We've got a little bit of wood. We can get that started started up. Um, I always need a lot of wood because I'm always making yeah, ashery and all that kind of stuff. See how this is going to work out. We're going to get our smelter in here. Humans have arrived. Okay. Here come the humans with their camels. There's egg yolks laying on that table. It didn't belong to them. Uh, well, I have I got some scepters for you. I may have some gems for you, too. What are you guys going to have for me? I can't wear your, your armor. Where's the cut stuff? Oh, these are rough gems. Um, let's just do, the, do the, the cut ones. Enemies can climb over walls, yes. Some enemies can fly as well. I'll sell you that stuff. I'll take, take whatever you got. Bring all that stuff in, we'll sell it, we'll make some money. One trick you can do is you, you build up and then you build over. So if I build up here and then I put like a wall, this next floor goes out. So if they climb, they can't, you can't like climb out. You know, they have to climb up and over. They can't go backwards. So that's a good way of, of building up like a, like a tower, a defensive tower. They can't climb up that. Um, doesn't look quite as pretty, but. 
Emeralds, you got lead. Silver. Uh, you do have a bunch of wood. I might just take all the wood you've got. You have a birdie. Some berry wine. Sure. I can't wear your, your clothing. Too big. I don't need any sand. I'm good on cloth. Um, I might have to just start, start making some leather stuff. I might have to just go in there and... Uh, thanks, Skin Gold, for hanging out. Um, I might have to just go in there and start making like leather armor for my, my warriors because I don't have anything. Just so they have something. Anvil. I'm really going to see if you've got something like valuable. Besides cheese. Iron meat cleaver. I didn't know that was a thing. Can I use that as a weapon? I got nothing. That's only a hundred bucks. That's with me getting the the, the the leather from them. That's all their leather, right? I'll pick up a little bit of cloth. I have plenty of bags. I think I'm going to buy... Yeah, I'm just going to stock up on wood. I have silver blocks. Um, I can make a war hammer out of that. I can whip these up into something. They don't have anything... Uh, Fuel-wise. Gizla. Coolanite sast. Okay, that's what? That's 400 bucks. I will give you that. I'll make you happy, so there you go. That'll work. I should actually, I should, I should do the scepters first. Okay, take my scepters, and then you can have the gem. Whatever else. Okay. Alright. I should make more scepters. I've got a lot of traders this time. Make them out of uh, rock, rock scepters. It's a big, big money maker this time. Maybe that crown. Anyone put that crown on their head? Uh, Soul wants to go eradicate some monsters. Uh, yeah, I would love your idea to come in here and knock some monsters out. Soul, Soul the human, monster slayer. Okay, so like we wood ferns, we can come here, we can make some charcoal. Um, I should put it as a work or work order. Charcoal, and we we'll keep it like I don't want a lot of it. We'll go down like that. I think I would like some ash as well, just a little bit though. Don't go crazy with the ash. Um, we do it here. Same thing. We're gonna lower it down to. Like two. Um, and then smelter, once we get that charcoal in here, we can start getting something done there. I'm going to go ahead and get a stockpile here. And I'm going to line it up. Let's try to be a little more organized here. That is going to be I'm going to make another stockpile here of wood. There we go. And then this is my, my coal maker. So we'll set up stockpile right here of coal. Of, um, of, well, maybe we put it over. Well, we can put the bars just all on the side over there. Hey, blue zest. That was terrifying. I, I just, that scared me. How's it going, blue zest? Thanks for the raid. Uh, we're making, uh, silf silver, silver, well, we got a few different things. Silver, iron, and, uh, I'm just gonna set up on all, all the blocks. All the metal blocks, I think, is fine. Can go in there. Yeah, it's a small stockpile. We should make it a little bigger. Alright, more migrants have arrived. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> Thanks, Blue Blue Zest, for the raid. Well, I certainly appreciate that. <clears throat> I'll give you a, uh, a tour of the fortress. So, we have built a, uh, a pyramid. 
Come up. We're still in the beginning stages of it, but the pyramid is capped. We've got the pyramid. We'll put some glass up there eventually. But there is our pyramid. We'll get some ramps up there as well. Um, and we've done a little bit of stuff below grounds just to get set up. And uh, the goal for this whole playthrough right now, we've got, built a new world. And in this world, there are 46 dwarves in my civilization. These two spots here. That's all I've got. There's goblins everywhere. There's a human fortress nearby. A human tower, I mean, nearby. There's humans. There's elves. Um, and um, we are old empires. There was two dwarven empires. They got, both got destroyed in world gen. And so this one got conquered by the humans, which we're allied with for some reason. And this one was taken over by goblins. So we're down here uh, in a uh, in a desert, and we're building a uh, a pyramid in a in a black sand desert. So the goal for this is to rebuild the the, the dwarven empire. <clears throat> yeah, I know. I really wish we had Armok Vision to see my uh, my towers. Once it gets once Armok Vision gets done, I have to go back in. I made the the big green glass tower. Ended up being twelve stories. Once we get Armok Vision back, I'm going to have to go back in there and check that out. Because I really want to see it. I keep doing that. The eraser doesn't work like I want it to. I do that, and then, and then I erase, and then it's fine. Oh, well. Annex, yeah, long time ago. Uh, we're not the mountain home yet. I'm, I'm kind of guessing that we should get there pretty quickly. That's what I'm kind of hoping to see happen. I got no beds. Okay, let me go get Carpenter Man. Go make me some beds. And uh, here we do this way. Make me some beds and make me some uh, rock cabinets. We're kind of ugly at the moment. There's not a whole lot of... Um, not real pretty. But we're, we're getting there. Early stages and all. Chinchilla Woman Lasher is visiting us. All right, all right. There goes the humans taking off. Uh, someone has become the, her the holy turquoise. There she is, the chinchilla woman. Look at her. She's an animal trainer. Yeah, she knows chinchillas. There she goes. Her little face. Have a drink in the beautiful bar we've got down here. That should be one of my levels. Is it, is it a tavern of some kind? Maybe that's maybe that's level three. What is that? Oh, magnetite, magnetite's up here. Okay. Well, uh, can you do anything yet? Magnetite. Just do that as much as you got. Like if you got magnetite laying around, you go make some magnetite bars. I want to iron things. I'm gonna get ourselves a well, uh, an iron, a metal smith. And he is going to make me my weapons and armor and all this stuff. It's quite a vein. I just clicked on one little vein here of magnetite and we just dug this whole thing out. A ton of magnetite. Look at all that. Just laying everywhere in here. I'm just going to set this up like... Like this. I'm going to have a stockpile here of magnetite. And if there's any bituminous, I'll put that in there too. I need some of that. Okay. So get that stuff over there. Don't put it upstairs. It's, it's making a mess. Like this. I don't want this to have any metal ores in it. Okay. Migrants? Uh, no migrants. Yeah, I, I, I don't think we're going to get any migrants uh, ever. We might get a couple sprinkling in here, but we'll see. So ultimately, the goal is I'm gonna I'm gonna play around with this fortress for a bit, and um, and then move on to a new fortress later on, and try to see if we can rebuild the empire by having multiple fortresses, and um, see if we can get anywhere with it. So I want to make some iron breastplates. Let's make uh, I'll get one guy geared out real well. We'll make an iron battle axe, iron breastplates. We'll get an iron hat. Um, Iron legs and some iron boots. And uh, correct me if I'm wrong, there is no difference between 
an iron and a wooden shield. I'll still make an iron one. Someone said something along the lines of like a, like a leather shield is actually um, it's good because it's um, what was the reason? Because it's like lightweight or something. I don't know about that. Uh, I got no water. Well, I'm supposed to have an aquifer here. But we never found the aquifer. So if there is an aquifer, I don't know where it is. Yeah, because they lay wet. They 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 weigh less. Yeah, that's that's a thought. Try a little search over here. See if we can find an aquifer. This way. It'd be interesting to see if I could go back, um, like how it would be going back to the old, to the ASCII version. Was that a Dralfa out outside? What are you doing outside? You're supposed to be running around. Else, like not outside. Get those daggers of defense. Good name for my my defense squad. Some bunny uh, honey badgers need to get thrown away there. All shields block the same. Weight matters. Shields take damage when they block. So leather shields takes a few hits before it's destroyed. And steel outlasts ten dwarves. Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah, I, I get it. Expand this a bit. Can I expand it? No? Alright. Yeah, there was a couple really good tile packs, uh, texture packs. Um, I was really fond of um, Vetlinger. Vetlinger was great. And Iron Hand, which I think is, is the, the, the guys that worked on Iron Hand, I think the ones that worked on this. Okay, you guys can give up on the Dralfa. More limestone, limestone in this fortress? That's more magnetite. Okay, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll mine that out. I would like to find... There's a lot of limestone in here. Let's go ahead and just pick one of these. And start digging some more. More limestone for our pyramid. Yeah, that's cool. I that's one of the things that um, I like a lot is like whenever I can just at a glance, I can pull up my dwarves here and I can see who's in the military because I can see who's wearing armor, who's got the axes, and who's got the pick. I can see all that just by glancing at it. I like that. That's probably my favorite, a favorite thing in here. <clears throat> um here, let me uh let me do this since since this isn't working too quickly. So we want not there. I should be able to clear this out and then we'll put our walls in there. Uh my leather worker has withdrawn from society. I don't think I have any leather a little leather spot for him. How do I do this? How do I how do I do this? Uh, it's not lining up. Um, door, room. Like that. A. It's not gonna line up very well. Uh, did you find your spots? 
Uh, Loam really wants a leather worker. He doesn't have one. Uh, where is this guy? Loam? Strange mood. Yeah, yeah, what's the problem, buddy? You just want around, aren't you? Yeah, because I don't have a leather worker. Okay, uh, I will put one in. Oh, vampires can be visually identified? I haven't had a vampire yet. I didn't know that. How can you, um, what did it look like? Now I want one so I can see what they look like. Phoebus was the one I used, um, that I used to use. Until I discovered Vetlinger. Entertainment, uh, sure, Orma. Okay, miner, can't build any drinks. Okay, okay, Vobach is working on it. Good. You didn't need much. Uh, I want to make sure that my... This guy, not this guy, this guy, is making me some barrels. And there's a few trees around here. Need the logs. Yeah, I was worried about that. We'll chop what we can. There's a cactus down here somewhere. There it is. Oh, there's a nice trail of blood. That's nice. Pale with, with white hair. Huh. Uh, a, uh, a leather helmet. Good. Okay, we've got a bunch of bars here. Let's, we've got one set of, of stuff, I think, laying around. I don't know where my armor is. So it should be up here. Did someone grab it? Did they didn't make it. Oh, maybe I can't make it yet. Need refined, refined coal. Okay, we got no logs. <clears throat> howling wolves. Yeah, that's what I got here. I said a bunch of howling wolves. I started in a, um, in a. A haunted biome, and I just had a bunch of like scary, scary noises all the time. Oh, I guess move that's fine. Hey, Draven, how's it going? Oh, was that patched out already? I knew it was some mods to get rid of the, the annoying bird sounds. Oh, they've arrived. Hello. World the same as ever. Really, nothing new. Nothing new. Like something new. Quite a bit of wealth here. You don't need logs, do you? I am going to give you. I'll give you what gems I've got. And I am going to give you my scepters. I got a bunch of scepters. A whole bunch of scepters. 30, that's where all my limestone's going. It's, I'm going to the scepters. I should probably cancel those. <laughs> okay, I hope you like scepters. Um, we got a few, I guess. Okay, cats are growing up. Uh, let's, while I'm, uh, here, let's do this. So, I'm going to go get a cat. I'm going to slaughter a couple cats. Not that one. These two. And when we when we slaughter them, we're going to make sure we don't um, cook the fat. Mm, eggs. Lots of eggs. Food should be taken care of with all those eggs coming in. 
Some hen egg stew. There's some cat fat. I should get hauled over here and rendered. Okay, fat's getting rendered right now. Pause that fine meal making. Render that fat for me. There it is. I'm do a baby in this because when we get the the tallow, which I've got right now, before he goes make a meal out of it, which he's trying to do right now, uh, I'm gonna go into here and tell them to not use tallow. Not use cat tallow. Cat tallow is gonna be our source of of well, tallow. Okay, so now back over here. Uh, get the broker over there. All right. I I can make iron bars. I'll take all the wood you got. Ooh, that's a bunch. I'll take your instrument. Yeah, yeah. Um, an alpaca. Maybe, maybe. Go ahead and give me a couple of barrels of beer. Steel boots, huh? That'd be nice to have. I don't know that I need the leather. Unless I make an archer squad, which I guess I will. I think I've got quite a bit. Um, yeah, I'll take those greaves. Someone will wear them. That's it. Well, I'll take your greaves, and that's about it. We've hit the cavern, so we should have silk now. I'll take some boots. A thousand bucks. Do I have enough of that? I probably do. Yeah. Well, uh, it's still getting a profit of, profit of three hundred bucks. Not, it's not the best. Uh, but that's fine. Here we go. Kubuk is happy with this. Kubuk, uh, thanks, buddy. Why don't we go and make, uh, this a little bit fancier with another instrument? We'll put it in there, we'll do somewhere else. I guess we can put it, we can move it around if we need to. Instrument number two. Yeah, throw it on over there. Uh, with two gongs. What's better than a... Place with one gong. There's plump helmets growing in my dining room. Two gongs. All right, so that's been cleared out. So now we should be able to come in here and put w door, uh, walls up here. And I want it to be made of limestone blocks. I did that wrong. Who's fighting? I got 20 iron bars down there. Okay, so then we need just like a wall that goes around around this. And then... This wall will continue here. We'll move the stockpile out of the way. And like that. I'd like to, th th to get this a little more synchronized. Or a little more... What's the word I'm looking for? Um, not janky. That's the word. As it is, going to be kind of janky the way, that, the way that this corners work. Is what all on the material screen? That won't line up like I kind of want. Like I'd like it to line up with the way, but like it'd be nice if it was all the same. You know what I mean? Um, 
I'm gonna be that way unless I'm unless I change this one. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, symmetry. That's the word we're looking for. Dwarven symmetry. So let's do this then. And it'll work. Sorry, I'm being quiet. I'm trying to think. If um, if I did that... Door there. Door there. That would work, right? Is that... Is that uh, it's just going to be like one long line. Instead of having doors on the side, we could, put, we could put doors on the side. That doesn't look the same. How we do that before? So it went out like that, and then up. But it's not the same like distance, so it's kind of hard to do. Yeah, I don't see a way of doing that. Uh, well, okay, okay. Um. It's kind of a mess right now. And then that one's open, and then there's... How do we get over there? Yeah, this is going to be kind of a weird thing. This could be just one giant room here. I think. I was going to put my barracks up here. And um, it's going to be kind of small to squeeze it in there. But the barracks could be somewhere else. And then we can just have a spot here. Uh, just a burrow hallway here for them to stand in. It's really all we need. I got to find. Uh, you know, I'm going to have to have a way of getting out. Actually, I, uh, I should have an opening here. So they can get out into the hallway. I didn't think about that. They're going to come out here. It's, there's going to be walls there. So I do need to have this open up here, over here. Like that. And then... I'll have a wall there. And a wall there. These will be tiny rooms. These two corner ones. Then we'll go further up. What we got? Uh, Siba, I would always love to have you come in here and eradicate some monsters. Siba, tell, please tell me you're the chinchilla woman. I really hope you are. Ah, oh, you're a dang human. I don't want a human. Is that chinchilla woman still here? Nah, she left. Migrants? No migrants. I'm not going to get any migrants. I've got to find some some sort of coal of some kind. Limonite or uh, something. Ooh, we found a whole bunch more magnetite. Need some more bins. Nothing there. I haven't seen anything yet. In any of these levels. That jet. Not quite. What is uh, anhydrite? I don't know that one.
Big moles fighting a dog. We have chalk for our med bay that we make. We'll make one of these days. heard that if you mess with the path system, pathing system, it helps with um, with some lag as well. Um, oh yeah, I was going to turn this guy off of making, where is he? Yeah, let's, maybe we don't do that anymore. We need the, I need those scepters, but I think I need the limestone more right now. Who's been taking out? We'll have to put the floors back in. So that'll be a way out. And we'll have it'll come around this way. Yeah, it'll kind of work. So we'll do bed on one side. Ooh, I got a ton of beds. Cabinet, whatever else on the other side. These are going to be just bed rooms. There's not any benefit selling scepters. I just picked them just for fun. How do I remove... Oh. Speaking of lag, we got some. Okay, let's go build. Build those up. Right, it's not a weapon. It's yeah, it's just a, it's just a. Uh, actually, I don't know the point of them. Just something to sell. We have hit some sort of pathfinding issue. It's causing some issues here. Dining room could, could use could use some good looks. And I got a little bit of charcoal. Is that enough to do something here? I don't remember. Yeah, three bars and some charcoal. Yeah, whip up. The, yeah, there we go. Whip up another one. Uh, how about an iron hat? Okay, breastplate done. How about a um, some legs? We'll get one guy at least geared out. Charcoal's getting main. We'll do one. We'll do this like one at a time here. Legs. Uh, we'll get iron. Um, boot, and then gloves. So we get one guy geared out with some some proper armor. Hey, yeah, yeah, there we go. Someone's got some pants. We bought some pants, I think. That what we got? Yeah, yeah. So we're getting there. Could use a shield. Someone killed a titan with a book about mating. <laughs> we make pig iron right now? Oh yeah, I guess I guess so. Because of those that's messing up? Yeah. Okay, so I just want to... Um, I want a little pigtail stockpile. Same thing here. We'll do pigtails when we can, plump helmets when we can't. 
also, I forget, the kitchen. I think it, because it didn't used to default to where they, uh, they would eat the pigtails, but I think they do now. Well, someone told me they did. Yeah, draw the tallow in there too. We'll, we'll save that. Yeah, it really depends on, um, it varies. Like, uh, I had, my first fort I did was, was really chugging there for a while at certain points. But the last one I did was fine. And we actually had, I had more people in the last one. I had, what, 170 in that, gra that green glass tower? That one ran real smooth. I never had any, any frame rate problems with that one. I'm going to remove this stock, the stock bomb. Put some walls in there. FPS death. Um, yeah, it kind of depends on what it's. It's, re it's not as bad as it used to be. Um, but again, it really depends. Like that first fortress I had, it did come to it. I had to retire and come back because of smoke and fire. And I've seen a couple of people talk about that. Be a big room there. Winter's hit us. The Lord Consort is here. Oh, yeah. Elf Craftsman Frozen Hunter is visiting us. What does that mean? What's a Frozen Hunter? You? Oh, you are. You're blue. Not you. You. You're a. You're. Not you. Where are you? You. You are blue. Ooh, you're legendary. Um, okay. She has a feel for music. Often feels lustful. Hmm. Member of the form, uh, so former member of the Silvery Communion, who's these folks here. Hey, Drongo! And my entire surface burned down with with pretty minimal FPS drop, which is impressive. Oh, nice. I've had it, the only time that really hit me was, like, I've had it in, um, in downstairs, it, like, it stopped me, but I've had fires up, up on top, and it was fine. So something, something with downstairs. Uh, I'll take the soldier, and I don't want, I don't, I'll, I'll take you, I guess. The two folks that want to be soldiers, I'll put in the squad. Uh, you guys. So we've got a couple humans want to come in here. You come on in, humans. And a goblin in my fortress. Yeah, something with the smoke in the spaces. Yeah, I think you're right. I have one, two trees in this whole fortress. Can we grow trees? Like, they'll, they'll... Oh, you know, we got trees down below. Yeah, let's chop these down. Last thing we want on this world is trees. Elves get kind of cranky about that, but we can we can deal with that later. We'll go downstairs and get some some uh, mushroom trees dug out. Okay, that goes to the end with limestone. Limestone blocks seem to have stopped. Oops. Rock blocks. 
Uh, the moral knowers want to... I, I don't know. Who, who are you, moral knowers? Is there a bunch of you? Like, if there's like a whole herd of you. You're a bunch of goblins. Man, I don't... I, no, I, you're just gonna, like, clog up my place. It's tiny. A performance troop is visiting us. Timta. Grizzly Spring. Oh, that's... Okay, that's a name. Okay, yeah. I let people in based on their names. Timta Grib... Uh, uh, the goblin can come in here and sing anytime. Um, let's see. So, uh, one of the one of the jobs I used to have back back in the day, pre YouTube days, uh, I was a uh, I was a street sweeper. More specifically, I was a cul de sac street sweeper. Little 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 uh, uh, get to know nook day, and uh, I I had to stop though because it was a dead end job. Stone. <laughs> Cleric of Cynic. Thank you for the sub. Floor there. Wall there. Wall there. Wall there. Floor there. Okay. Floors there. All that. And then these will be floors. <laughs> Cold to sacked. No. I didn't get fired. I quit. It says to introduce yourself, introduce yourself with a dad joke, so I'll contribute as well. Where do dairy farmers get their bachelor's degrees of science? Cowtech. <laughs> I hope you're ashamed of yourself. I think so. I think that dad joke got me a sub, didn't it? I should tell more dad jokes. <laughs> uh, do we have doors down here? Anybody making me any doors? Uh, oh, cabinets. I got cabinets. I got a doctor's office stuff. Uh, I thought my... Oh, it's packed in there. Look, there's too many of you. I can't fit you in here. Uh, yeep them. Get out. Charcoal done. Good. I need logs. <sighs> <laughs> Dad joking my way to Christmas. <laughs> Dad jokes are paying for Christmas this year. <laughs> All right, so limestone. There we go. You think that mudstone looks the same? Let's do a little experiment and see if mudstone looks the same as limestone. Because if it does, that'd be rather that helpful. Um, kind of. Can't tell. Okay, now, uh, what's going on over here? Sunny has been possessed. Sunny, what's going on, Sunny? I'm a weaver. Uh, I don't have a loom. Should probably get one of those. She's probably she's not gonna she's not gonna want a loom. She's gonna gonna want a clothes maker. For sure. But I'll make a loom, and then we'll get a clothes maker in here. What was that? Dropsticks, thank you for the sub. Thank you very much. Um what, did the dad joke get you too? Because I'll I'll tell dad jokes every ten minutes if I have to. Recommendations for YouTube tutorial that explains why decisions are made. My attempt at at my tutorial was 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 to get that point across that there is no right or wrong way to play Dwarf Fortress. Like um, I tried to get that point across. I'm not sure I did a good job of it. But that was my goal. Um. Pigtails. No pigtails in here. Um, but uh, I don't know. 
I don't have an answer for you. I want you to not weave thread, please. Alright, there we go. Yeah, claim by Sunny. Sunny will go grab some cloth and stuff and go make that. Okay. Um It doesn't look it doesn't look it doesn't look bad. Put your pick out. What are you doing? Don't put your pick down there. Let's get some cabinets. Get Eleven of these. Okay, so here we go. There's my bedrooms. Not everyone gets a cabinet, but some people do. This is a fancy room here. This will be like um I don't know, the the mayor or something going here. Do we have any beds? This place is a dump. <laughs> Spiders laying around here. Look at all these rocks I got dug out. And still no coal. And we're ready for the traders next year. Are you, um, oh, what, what's what's the deal? What are you missing? You're missing cloth, thread, gems. Oh, you probably need some cut gems. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Uh, cut gems, just cut them. Gremlin, gremlin. Did you get him, kitty? Where is he? Where? Oh, there he is. Eh, he's leaving. Okay, begun construction. Good. Um, I think we're ready to go ahead and get some training done with our squads here. We are decently trained, but I still think we need something. So let's go ahead and schedule up some, some orders here. Uh, I would like you to train. I don't want all of you to train, but we've got, what, six in the squad, so we'll set... We'll set four of them to train. And then I want the other two to go and patrol. And let's do, like, an exciting patrol route. So we'll go, um... We'll go... Do we want to go outside? Yeah, we'll go outside. We'll, we'll patrol around the fortress. You know, a little, uh, little walk around. Um, I guess we do that, and then and then back over. How many of these can I do? And then we'll go inside. We don't need to go upstairs, but we'll go downstairs. We'll stop. We'll stop um, down here. There's always some things going on down here, and then we'll and then we'll go all the way down. B big route to there. Then you can go back up. Okay. Uh, I, I don't want all of you doing that. Did I set four up? I did, didn't I? I don't want that. I did that, I did that wrong. Four of you train. I want... Maybe we should just set up a burrow here. Pigtail hood. I'm gonna just gonna station somebody to stand. I'm gonna station two people to just stand down here. It won't take care of the upstairs, though, if we do that. We got two people here standing here and down. So if something comes through through here, like a gremlin or whatever, they can fight that. Upstairs is more of a problem. But when we get more people in the squad, then we'll then we'll add someone up there. Oh, I didn't set the schedule up right. Uh, yeah, that one. That's right. All right, any monsters? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please, please. Uh, there's another frozen, a, hu a frozen human. What's with all these frozen people? Mm, we should do a work order here with some clothes. Let's make. I would like some bags. We're gonna need. We're gonna need some of those. We'll just make ten bags. And I'm gonna have to. If I do a lot of, at least I'm gonna start getting some thread done. Which, we will do once we get, like, I could tell him to do the thread thing. I'll wait for the doctor first. The perk of having these walls here is this is all laid out now. Like, I don't need to put floors there. We got walls. But we'll go to the next level. We can go up. And I do want to get my, what are you guys doing up here? Oh, barracks. I do want to get my, um, uh, um, my, my, uh, my, my med bay done. 
med bay, offices, that kind of stuff, I think can fit up here nice. It's a very neat game, Vladi. I would say one of my favorites uh, ever. We'll start working our way that way. Figure out where we put our walls in. I need to go look and see if, if any of these guys are the frozen people, I want them to stay. So, Sinur. If Sinur or, uh, or Barn Owl Man. Wow. Look at that guy. Booth. Yeah, it's cold out there. I get it. We have too many iron bars. Nice problem to have. Uh, down here in the caves, we have trees. Isn't isn't there uh, something to go chopping? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do some chopping. Chop these trees. What else is down here? Where are you going? Oh, he's eradicating monsters. Go get them gremlins. Seems to be some some debate there. I think I didn't think there was, but I think there is a difference with uh, with bucklers and shields and all that. Um, I didn't think there was, but apparently there is. That's what I'm trying to say. Need a new bag, huh? All right, um, and we're making beds. I think I, did I set. I didn't never set the water up, did I? Make some more beds. Yeah, this drought is a problem. Let's go get him. Ooh. Bloody. Hey, pick your gloves up. This is my attempt to find another aquifer and we didn't find it. Or a aquifer, I should say. Can't make any more any more of those because we need uh, we need more cloth for bags. So we can't make any more bags. Yeah, we we'll see my pyramid. Pyramid's pyramid's done. Like it is, it is a, a step pyramid at the moment. We haven't got all the ramps in, but it is a pyramid. Um, I just got. I want to put some glass on top. We haven't got there yet. We're working on getting the floors done now. So we got the we have the base floor, which is animal land. There's some fighting going on. Giant bat. Oh, way down here. There's a, uh, oh, Isaac's, or Iskak's left ears laying down there. Is that you? Is that your name? Yeah, buddy, you left your ear behind. You got, you got the bat. Giant toad. It's gonna be kind of nasty. Soldiering, I like that. I'll take anyone with the soldier. The lady consorts, huh? So we could station her out here. Or whoever. Let me go work out that schedule and edit it. And just, we're going to add one more. We're going to station someone here on the bridge. So I want one more stationed there. That way, if any like badgers or whatever come in here, we should be able to handle that. Uh, 
Nice. Nice, GM GMT. Okay. Um, I want to go... What I want to do is I'm going to make this like a big... Uh, all bedrooms at one time. I know I could probably do it. I got one door. That's it. Let's go make some doors. Make them out of rock. More than ten. Bunch of doors. And uh, we'll get our beds in here. Okay, so that gives us what? Six, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen? Fifteen bedrooms? Ah, eh, that's not too bad. That's... That's, that's uh, not the best. We're still going to have to have a... a, a, a uh, well, if I put my barracks in a different spot, my barracks beds, that might be nicer. We'll still need more beds, though. Okay, once the doors comes in here, we'll make one big bed thing. This is my bedroom right now. It's kind of uh, hideous. Oh, my hood. No one wearing that hood? Let's put it on display somewhere. Oh, this tavern is just garbage. Tables and rock thrones. Ten, ten more of those. Oh yeah, yeah. We get a multiple. That would be cool. Uh, so I was thinking, like, um, yeah, multiple, multiple mirrors, or having like an like obelisks kind of stuck outside for uh, for our like like a uh, station for our, our archers. How much thread do you think I have? Not a bit. Is there a way of telling them to make... I guess there is a way of telling them to make thread out of a specific thing. Like if, like if we get pigtails, they can make cloth out of that. <laughs> silk. Let's not do that. Then we can have always have silk threads around. Sticks and stones. Thank you for the sub. The glass tower still stands, but we uh, we're, we're moving on to new new things, new experiments here. We have a dead civilization, and we're trying to rebuild it. Our entire civilization has forty six dwarves in it. We now have thirty five here. I'm hoping that we get to have a king or queen here real soon. I think we'll get there. Now that's my. I think once we get once we get that, then I'm gonna build it, go out. I'll, I'll retire this and let the AI handle it, and then go build another fortress and see if we can get the dwarves back because we have these these three settlements are all we own and that one's grown a little bit that's up to 50 now the comedic irons over there you know what it's in yeah um those those that's us it's these three spots we're allied with both the elves and the humans and then there is we're at peace with well our people um, and then we've got the uh, a tower over there of undead things next to us. Yeah, I want to try to find a world that we could stick with. Um, just try this out. More doors. I need some more cabinets too. What does it mean dug out? I 
don't like that being so close to the surface. Actually, I don't want to do that. I'm going to I'm going to cancel that. It's too close to the surface and it's too easy to get holes down there. Maybe we should just take We've got spots down here. Okay, are we going to win? Got my station guys that that fought down there. Siba and L and Logue. No, must be the the uh the, just the adventure people. I'm gonna take one of these rooms here and make it into my my tavern. Got <laughs> got one. Well, there we go. There's, there it is. There is our new, <laughs> new meeting hall. Uh, I want meeting area. Yeah, this is gonna be classy. One table and chairs. Uh, in tavern, and it's also going to be a dining hall. Okay. There we go. Give him some more space here. We'll smooth this out. Ooh, there's a bunch more magnetite over there. Ooh, I'm going to stop mining here. Um, hey, the elves will come back. Okay, so a door back up. So when we get some doors made. Here come the elves with their unicorns. Uh, I got some junk to give you. I have... You can have my bolts. I'm not using them for anything. I'm not sure why we... Maybe we come with those. Um, you want some body parts? Uh, I will give you some scepters. You like scepters, right? I heard you love scepters. Well, I got some scepters for you. Not as many as I thought I did. And that's all I got. You want your hat back? Nobody wants it. I do have some gems. We'll bring them over there just in case they like they. Uh, I find something good. Ooh, there's a lot of money there. They got something good. I'll I'll I'll, I'll take them. I keep hearing, yeah, I, uh, that was recommended to me today. Um, Hoodie Hair has a video on a unicorn farm. Yeah, I'm going to have to watch that. I did one, old Dwarf Fortress time, I did a, um, a zoo. Tried to collect a bunch of animals up. I got attacked by undead, so it kind of broke. But, the beginnings of a zoo. I never got a unicorn, though. Last time you guys had garbage. You have garbage again? You have garbage again. I'm tempted to just give you some wood stuff just to make you mad. You got nothing. Um, hmm. Here, take this. And just give me the wood, I guess. I got a bunch of it, but... There you go. Use a uh, like a like a barrel of water. You have some of that. Probably could put some bins down here. I think that would probably do uh, do some me some good. Lord Consort is fighting a leopard man. Did you get him? Yep, there he is. And uh, into the dump he goes. Quick. That was a barn owl man. You fight the barn owl man? What's going on over here? I'm 
You having trouble with this leopard man? Well, I'll, I'll help you out. In this this bar now. Here you go. I'll give you a hand. You got a problem with that bar now too? I'll, I'll help you out. It's not. Animal product. They get mad about animal products too. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think so. I'm gonna try to figure out a way of getting a doctor up here. Big enough for a doctor? Yeah, plenty big for a doctor. Um, I don't know if I should use the closest material, but uh, it's fine. Um, so, with a doctor, I want like offices and things up here also. Let's put an office over there. I need buckets. Me buckets for? Do you have any bees on this map? That would be that would solve a, a drink problem also. I know I've seen I know I've seen some. They take, they take a little bit of effort to get started. Helms baby, hey Lawler, how's it going? Yeah yeah they'll they'll slaughter them. Animals will get. Migrants have arrived really. Hey, look at those, look, migrants. Hooray. Oh, a bunch of them, too. Where'd you come from? I'm curious where you came from. Let's go pick one of them. Uh, Ming, where are you from? Where is your, uh, groups? Nope. Um, I don't know, where's your, like, your history, right? How do I know? Hmm. I wonder where he came from. Yeah, to 55 now. There are now more more people living in this fortress than there is in the entire civilization. The entire um, um, dwarven civilization. I'm going to redo this. Okay, so we want to get water buffalo, donkey. I'll probably slaughter most of these. Most of these. We can milk the cow, and we can get we get a uh, thread from the llama. So we brought a whole herd of water buffaloes. Uh, Silver communion has many worshippers. What now requires a temple complex and a high priest. Yeah, I do approve of that. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. So I have, right now, we're not anywhere near there. We, we're at, what are we? We're at 6,000. Actually, we're not, we're not too far. So we only need to get, I think, maybe 10,000. And we can get there. Uh, if I can build a couple of pedestals, maybe we can squeeze in there. I think we should be somewhere nicer, though. Ideally, like, in, in the tavern. Right in the tower, I mean. Like, up here. That's the whole point. So the doctor's gonna go here. Let me get some floors in here. The mudstone works, it's the same color. So I'll put that in there. Um, so if we do a hallway here, we could have, yeah, we'll just have a door Yeah. 
symmetry. Yeah, symmetry. So we'll have doors, door, doors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then uh, they might have actually a hallway here and have it. We can have multiple things over here. But if we want something big, like um, over here, like a barracks can be up here. Um, I don't know. I don't know what we something. I do want to go ahead and get a floor placed up here. We got a lot of uh, floors and things to get made. How many of those walls I was putting in? Oh, it does look a little different. Uh oh. Uh, Craft Dwarf. Okay. Sandstone's got that one. Share a caster was what? What was share a caster? It wasn't my door, was it? Is it the hood? What was share a caster? Somebody stole it. There's too much stuff. I have no idea where we would even begin to look. Can we see here? What's here? What, what was share? <laughs> I don't know what that was. Uh, does it show up in objects? It's it's a leather. It was a leather hood or hat or something. It's not where it's supposed to be. Yeah. Stop losing stuff. Somebody stole it. <clears throat> Where are you? What, 55 people here? No frozen people, though. Or owl people. Yeah, that's a problem. I guess it was, that, that was a proper place. Sure. Who's stinking this place up? That guy. Get out of here. No, no thip. Last time I lost something, I had to go kind of look around, and and it showed up, it showed up in one of these. But I don't even know really where to look. Oh, they've lost people. They've, I guess, some people moved from there because it was fifty there a minute ago. Now there's forty. I guess they moved down to us. Six thousand goblins live there, and and hate weakened. That's a lot of goblins. Let's not make them mad. Uh, that's possible. Actually, we'd be able to see it, wouldn't we? Someone there has it. I don't know. Anybody want to fight? Looks like Irush likes to fight. And uh, Tulin's a novice. That works. Fancy amulet. Adequate fighter. Adequate fighter is good. Adequate fighter. Sure. Um, no, my trapper can do it too. Okay, so there we got a squad of, of 10. I need to make more stuff. I got a ton of iron bars. I got to make some more stuff. In fact, we got too many. We need bins. Let's just make up a work order here of, of iron. We'll do iron, what do we want, breastplates first? Ten iron breastplates? We don't need quite that many, we can do like, I think we can get away with eight of those. And we'll do iron helms. I do need ten of those, I think. Um, iron 
battle axes. I'll do um, nine of those. I never make bins, um, because they were kind of buggy before. I guess it's okay now. But anyway, I probably should get out of that out of that bad habit of not making bins. Okay, um, I want to get that pedestal put in here, make this place fancy. Eventually. No, nothing with the... Yeah, I haven't had any problems with bins yet in the Steam version either. So hopefully that's been fixed. Okay. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and do it. Bedroom, multi... 13 bedrooms. That counts as... Oh, it does count as... Nope, nope, don't do that. I need a door. I need two, three more doors. I'm working on it. Make those now. I'm surprised nothing has attacked us yet. Still on there, right? Yeah, normal difficulty. Anyone tried hard difficult, hard enemies? What's that do? I want to see what, what we get there. That might be probably a good idea. Uh, automate the bin. Yeah, that's a good idea. So the bins, like, set up to where... Uh, how do you do it? Wood, wood bin. Or... Um... We can make them out of iron. I have a ton of iron. I don't have a lot of wood. Well, yeah, we do. We got we got the stuff down below. So we could set this up as, like, make, like, two of them. But um, less than one, make one. That way, that way they'll always keep bins. Like, if we need a bin, they'll make a bin. And then everything will get binned up. And that'll make things a little easier on us and a little bit nicer. There's a door there. And we got two doors. Yeah, there's there's a cabinet, there's a bed. I think we might have enough stuff for something. Man. Hey Belial, how's it going? Thanks for the follow. Two doors. It's been actually a pretty peaceful day here. I say that. We'll see how it how it ends. Pedestal ever get made? I, I I probably should move the temple into somewhere a little nicer. But I want to hit that thing and then we can move it around. We're at what value you at? We're at six thousand. We need to get ten thousand. I've got some nice stuff around here. What? How much are you worth? We're three. What's the other one at? This hood is worth four. Getting there. So I guess we'll put the hood in there. Shows up as a head. Headwear? Yeah. Right. 
There we go. Temple complex. No instruments in here. We don't have any chests made. But it's done. We have to go satisfy the agreement now. Which is recognize a high priest. We got the, uh, the Dune is the first Earth. But now we're going to get Datan here as the Intimidator. I guess we'll put an Intimidator in there. Okay. So just a village. Yeah, the goblins are already near. Yeah, lots of goblin poets hanging around. Where's my dang doors at? I'm just gonna go here. What are you doing right now? Making thrones. Um, make make doors. Hey, look, it's so, it's so much nicer now. Look at those bins. Oh, well. The bins up there are nice. Okay. Those rooms are done. Let's get a door. I need two doors. <laughs> logs. Where's our entrance to this cave? Here. Set this as, as F2. A lot of action going on down here. Walking around everywhere. Where are those getting chopped? Are these getting chopped? This one. My woodcutter. Oh, because he's in the he's in the military. Okay, well, not you then. We'll let uh, Crystal and Olin can handle it. Okay, Shaney, you hunt. Mm, Hi, Master Miner, you get in there, Ming. Wait, plants. Okay. Should be getting done now. There you go. We struck some gypsum, I see. Look at that med bay done. How many beds left? I know I have a traction bench. And I need some chests. Ah, uh, where beast? The were lizard Zoo Zugot has come. A large lizard twisted into humanoid form. It is crazed for blood and flesh. Its eyes glow amber. Its raw umber scales are blocky and set far apart. You will know why you fear the night. Uh, I haven't been hit by a were beast yet this uh, this steam release time. I think we're going to just close the door. I don't want to be all cowardly here or anything, but I think we're just going to pull the lever. Uh, uh, Gatino, don't go outside, okay? Oh, oh, look at him. Can we do that now? Wow. Uh, where's he going? He's chasing a cat around. Some scared donkeys. What are you doing out here? Why are you going outside? <laughs> okay, look, look. I don't think you guys understand that I would like you to be inside. Oh, that's that's the other mod I got, is the symbols. The different symbols. 
Like, what is that? <laughs> That's what it was. Oh, we're gonna get we're gonna get an infected fort here. I know, I know we are. The cat was the cat did a good job until, well, everyone decided to go outside for some reason. If my military hopped hopped out from above, they saw it above and hopped out. Uh, let's do what should we do? Let's do um, uh, burrow. Make it make it red and uh, yeah yeah I like that. Okay, so we'll put everyone in here. Hopefully we can get him inside before he turns around and starts chewing. I meant to put some cage traps outside. I didn't. Okay. Uh, don't do that. It is on... So the cat's fighting. Everyone should get inside. I would like my military to not go and be dumb. Uh, why, don't, why, why don't you guys go and try this? Let's try going over here. Get inside. Get inside. There's a burrow. Get inside. Uh-oh. <laughs> I forgot to turn that off. Uh, pull the lever. <laughs> don't, don't stand there. Where is he? Where is he? He leave already? Why does Zugot have that symbol on him? Oh, that's... There he is. Um, I think, never mind, don't pull the lever. We got... Never mind. Don't pull the lever. Um, you two, you you guys. There's a few of you out here. You can handle this. Yeah, he took a piece of cake. Oh yeah, he's nothing. Uh, did you get bit? Yeah, you're 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 a problem. Stoder, did you get bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's take a look at the old combat report here. Uh, where lizard? So he's chewing on a cat for a while. Uh, he bites the cat. The doe rabbit. Oh, there's a bunny was chewing on you too? You're chewing on a bunny? Are you the leader? You're the leader, okay. So he's, he's, he's chewing on this, a lamb now. I can improve my fighting. It's satisfying, he says. So there's a barn owl hammerman out there apparently running around. Goblin spearman stabs. Lodges in the wound. Good, good. Misses. Leader charges. Collides. Knocked over. Spearman stabs. Leader bites the goblin spearman. Uh, but it's deflected. It's deflected. But he does latch on firmly. Is that enough? Is that enough to, to infect? Spearman stabs. Gem cutter punches. The leader shakes the goblin around. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the goblin's done for. Yeah, he's definitely done for. Okay. Attack and attack and gem cutter misses. Did you only worry about the gem cutter? Bites the goblins, or the, the spearman, I mean. Look, even the goats to attack him. He falls over. Gem cutter punches. Leader bites the spearman again. Um, the spearman has been, yeah, gnawed on with this a lot. Gem cutter punches. Axe dwarf hacks. Goblin spearman getting shaken around. The goat, the goat kid, gores the leader with a lower body with his right horn. Who's this goat? <laughs> this goat's a hero. Axe Dwarf hacks. Spearman stabs. Still chewing on there. The, go the goat the goat is the is back at it again. Kicking. Bruising it. Kicking it. Uh, the gym cutter's kicking now. 
I'm taking notes from that 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 goat. Axdorf is hacking. The leader grabs the goat. Spearman stabs. The leader takes the goat kid down by the left front leg. Uh, Jim Cutter is punching. Throws the goat kid. Um... What do you call an empty car? Uh, what do you call an empty jar of cheese whiz? Cheese was. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was that was real bad. The the leader bites the goat kid. The axe dwarf hacks the leader in the upper body, the were were lizard, with her axe, and the part is cloven us under, under, and the axe is lodged in the wound, and then he's dead. He's dead. That's it. Where's that? There's the goat right there. A deal. Uh, you need a name. Your name is is, um, your name is Goat Monster. Uh, slayer of, of of, werebeasts. Oh, werebees. I'm gonna change your name here. Instead of being Goat Kid, you're just gonna be Hero. Okay, don't forget this guy. He is a heroic goat. Don't let the goat, heroic goat die. The goblin spearman is done for. The goat nader. That's even better. Um, the this guy's or I think this guy. This guy's the one who was hacking. Jim Cutter's also the one who was punching. We can't have you back in here. Rozu, are you my squad? Who's who are you? Oh, you're just a mercenary. You're just out hanging around. You're not in my squad. Rozu? Oh, yeah, there you are. Okay, so Rozu, I want you to go and... <laughs> I want you to go stand right there. <laughs> Everyone else stay away. Everyone else go the other way. Just just Rozu goes there, okay? <laughs> Everyone else. Everyone else goes elsewhere. Um. <laughs> okay, I want everyone to go stand, like, over here. Okay, but I want Rozu to stand right here. That goat kid is the goat. That's right. Back up. Rozu, where are you? Are you? Oh, you're bleeding out and all that. I can't attack you, can I? Can we, like, kill Rozu? We know he's bad. Rozu, why don't you come stand over here, buddy? I don't understand what the problem is. Open that door. He's going to come in there. He's going to chew on all of us. Well, that's all right. We'll open the door. We'll uh, we'll we'll station him away somewhere. He, I think he's, whoops. I think there was a cat under there. You okay there, buddy? Tekken? He's fine. This guy's bleeding out. Um, what we could do is, yeah, he's going to have to get exiled. How do we do that? Do we just build a wall around him? Because he may be hurt and not be able to get up, but once he gets healed, he's going to be a problem. Out of the way, cat. He's, he's too far gone now. Can we cast him out? How do we do that? That one? Oh, look at that. That one? Turn this creature to, to Link Sight or expel this creature entirely. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. He's ready to leave. Okay. Well, I don't need you going around and like hacking anyone else up. So I think we'll uh, we'll do the world a favor. And uh, well, I don't know. I don't want him biting me. Oh, he can move. He's just bathing in. All right. Get out. He's gonna come back. He's gonna come back, and. He's going to be a real problem. Uh, let me get rid of this burrow. Okay. Uh, who's that? 
Tulin, are you, um, what happened to you? Clumsy. It's mangled. I didn't see you get bit, though. I didn't see any mention of him getting bit. You think he got bit? He wouldn't be hanging out there all bleeding if he didn't get hit, though. No, I think it was a different goat, wasn't it? Hero goats down there, down there making some leather. Hmm. We'll have to station him somewhere else. Tulin, I'm gonna have to put you. Um, let's make you a little home. I'm not too far down. Let's get, uh, we'll just like build him a little spot right here. Oh, here, we'll just do it in here. Build you a little, um, a little, little hole over here. And, uh, do we need a bridge for this? Can he break through doors? I don't think he can. I didn't used to be able to. We'll find out. I'm going to borrow Tulin down here. Yeah, that's that's good good symbol for that. And this one belongs to wherever Tulin. Is Tulin. The trapper. Okay. We'll put him in there, we'll lock the door, and uh, we'll find out real quick if he's a problem or not. Uh it is my bedtime, and um I think we're going to have to go out. Have to go uh, end it there. So we got um, the beginnings of something here. I do want to end on a, a, an even higher note. Not the fighting, but a couple of doors. Oh, I'm short one more door. I'll put the door down there. Give me one more door, please. Look, I don't care who does it. Look, uh, not you. You, make, make me one more, one more door. One more. Is he still out there? He is. He must have got hit by that. Um, I didn't see anything mentioned of a trapper getting bit. But I don't know what else... What else could have gotten him? He must have gotten grabbed and I just missed it. You got a door yet? Yeah, make a door. You got ta tables and cabinets under there. Making a door right now. Where's our hero goat? So he doesn't show up, I don't think, in, in here. Oh, it does. Go. Yeah, it does show up now. Goat monster. Owned by Ticket. Where is he? Yeah, he's right there. Stamina's a little low, but he's kind of a hero. Silica's been found dead by a giant olm. Oh, yeah. I guess we. Did we get it yet? No. Glassjaw is busy fighting it right now. Okay, well, everyone get in, get in here and kill this thing. We had a dead dwarf. Our first dead dwarf. Well, going to be our second dead dwarf. Okay, now we can do it. Bedroom multi. There you go. 15 bedrooms. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. Except. Hooray! That's nice. Now we got bedrooms. Everyone get a, go see your bedrooms. A after we go deal with this. Where's that old mat? You guys are supposed to be eradicating monsters. You're doing a bad job of it. He's still out there. 
he's not out there anymore. Is he in his spot? Is he, are you in your home? Tulin, I need you in your home. Caravans have arrived. Tulin, where are you at? No, you, you are still out there. Tulin, I guess we can just kick you out. I'm just going to kick you out because, you know... Just get out of my fortress. Don't come back here. What are you doing? Don't come back. Where are you going? No, no, no. It doesn't mean come back. Get out. I don't want to hurt you. He's ready to leave. Okay. Do that then. He's going he's gonna to go visit the tavern and then he's going to chew on everyone whenever he turns. Oh, I don't want him to be here. I don't I don't want to kill the guy. I'm going to have to. Because if he turns when he's in here, it's just going to be like uh, no good. Is what it's going to be. Hmm. Yeah, he's in here just having a drink. Having a good old time. Bleeding all over the place. Where is he? Where'd he go? Tulin, there he is. He's a visitor. Tulin, I can't. What are you doing? Are you leaving? He's drunk. Ready to go. Okay. Sorry, buddy. I just can't have you living here. You know? Uh, nothing against you. It's just... Well, it's just a problem that uh, happens... When the, moon gets, when, the, when the moon gets full. Why is there an attraction bench laying right there? Okay, I'm going to make this a doctor's office. The inky home. Alright. Where, uh, where lizard? Still out there. You can see it. There he is. Cave toad fighting down there. Or all they go, they'll come back when, a, when, a, when the full moon hits. They'll come back and attack me. Probably. Oh yeah, we have early summer, so we'll get a caravan next time. I'm hoping we get some news next time. Maybe they'll go and like promote us. We're 53. We've got a value of 61,000, so we're getting somewhere. Um, I could tell my stonemason's very busy. I should probably should make another one of those. Uh, what? Grit transformed into a were lizard. Grit, what'd you go and do that for? Grit, but you didn't get bit by anything. I looked at the report. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> That's Cape Card out. Where's. Grit bled to death. Where is it? There he is. Bites the gem cutter in the foot. Uh oh. That's from bef I did. How did I miss that before? He went and fought the Ulm. Um. Who? Um. That's Cave Crocodile. Okay. Lock the door. You should get out of the way, cat. Dog. Get out of the way so I can lock the door! Those dang cats, I can't lock the door and they're gonna be stuck. Oh boy. I can't lock the door. Lock the door. Or can I lock it now? Here we go. Lock the door. Just lock the door. Don't worry about it. Don't think about what's going on in there. Mm -mm. 
You want to visit our tavern? You're going to have to go to the other tavern. This one's closed. Where lizards? Are they door? Are they building destroyers? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. What was I going to do? I was going to go get some more um, stone. We can make some stone statues. We could maybe make some iron statues, I guess. Or something. People are gonna cry about water sources. They're gonna get real mad because it's gonna get it's gonna get kind of kind of um, bad in there. Yeah, if you can manage to get a were beast like a were beast fort that actually works without killing everybody, it can be pretty nice. I've never done it before. I've I've heard stories. But yeah, they're great because they they every time they they basically have great healing. Same as like a vampire. Vampire is great to have in your fort, but also not so great. There can be some there can be some side effects. Uh, I forgot to mark my my uh, doctor in here. Diagnostician will be glass jaw, surgeon, niche, and bone doctor is cog. Cog the novice. I need a chest in there. I don't think I have any chests. Carry my soap, which I haven't made yet. No barrels. Uh, I forgot about you guys. Um. Nah. Okay, so someone might turn in here. If no one turns for a while, it's summer right now. We'll be fine. I don't think it's gonna happen. I think it's gonna have some issues. I think people probably got out. Hopefully they're just visitors and they've left by now. I don't think that's gonna happen though. Actually, I guess we can see right here, can't we? What happened to you? Did you guys all get hit by that thing? You did, didn't you? Um, okay. I got too many cats in this fortress. Cat is sparring? The cat is sparring? <laughs> There's a cat training in them. I've never seen that before. Aid, you're fine. Get out of there, Aid. You're trying to do doctor things. Mayfold, get out. Leave. Don't you leave. What are you stand there for? You no job, you're just gonna stand there? All right, Mayfall, you've lost your opportunity. I'm gonna lock these in because they're in there, so I'm assuming that means that they know that there's something bad.
helmet sneak. That's done. We can finish up our our place, our, our temple, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm in a desert. Okay, there they go. Humans are out of here. Anyone pay attention to what day that uh, that that full moon hit? Well, we can see it, I guess. We can see the moon right there. We got a Melsmith Forge. <laughs> uh, just in case, just in case they can get out, we build a wall. Um, I don't, I'm. Do we want to put a wall there? And then, yeah, let's just do it, just to make sure. I don't think they can get out of that. I'm pretty sure they're stuck in the walls, but that's how it used to be. So I don't know how it is now. I just need a, one wall right there. Would be enough, actually. Oh man. Oh man, it's carnage. Did they get one of the did they get one of them? He is chewing them up. Man, that's quite a that's quite a tavern. You guys are all in there, right? No one's getting no no one got out. There's no wear lizards just like running around. These guys are all okay. Okay, you guys are free to go. Nice tavern. <laughs> okay, he's back to uh, his old self. I think we just we just leave it locked. Like I'm sorry. Um, uh, yeah, Goostum went back into a human. Which one is Goostum? But he's he's bit everyone now. Uh, Mang is in there. Who's one of my original guys? He's a little pale. They got my puppy. As long as my my goat isn't in there. So, um, I'm gonna go to bed here. Just don't let me forget that we have a wear lizard problem uh, in the tavern. Don't let me forget. Don't open that door. It'd be a bad idea. I want to get my stuff over here, but uh, I guess I can't get through there, so we can go ahead and remove, remove that. Migrants have arrived. Yay. Farmer Hall has been established. Farmer Guild, huh? In the desert? Yeah, he would have gone differently if Goat was in there. <laughs> is that little goat right there? Yep, there he is. He's got a tick on him, he's got a louse on him. Poor guy. We got like, what, three migrants came in? Uh, whatever you do, don't don't go to the other ta the uh, the tavern. You go go to the one down below. All right, so they want a farmer guild hall. I will do it uh, tomorrow though. I'm gonna go to bed. So thanks for hanging out tonight for the Dwarf Fortress stream. Um, I cannot wait to start seeing some expansion from my people. Let's see if it works. Um, I kind of want to start a war with the other folks because we're only at war with this tower here and they're not doing anything. I wonder if they, I'm sure they're gonna show up there before too long and we'll have to start. Chopping some heads off. It's gonna be real ugly. Um, I'll get. I think the next goal, the goal next time is gonna be getting these this squad properly geared out. We have enough armor for everyone, but that's about it. And uh, I'd like them to 
you know, be able to fight. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's quarantine. Yep. A little bloody in there. A little bloody in there. If you get bit by a were lizard or were whatever, um, then uh, full moon is bad. All right. Thanks for hanging out. Save and call it a day. Uh, what is tomorrow? Tomorrow is Monday or Tuesday morning. I guess it's, I guess tomorrow's Tuesday, technically. Um, I will not be here. I probably won't be streaming tomorrow. Um, you can keep an eye on the Discord, but probably not. But I'll be here the next time. Next day. I should. And, um, I'm going to head to bed. So, thanks again for hanging out here. For another Dwarf Fortress stream. Um, who do you want to go raid today? We got right in today. Let's see. Let's go um, go find someone new here on uh, Dwarf Fortress streamer. Um, we just raided Sal last night. or Yeah, last night, didn't we? So, let's go to uh, Kiwo over here. Yeah, we'll go over here. All right, thanks again for hanging out. Uh, I will be back in a couple days and we'll probably play more Dwarf Fortress but if something else comes up we'll play something else thanks for hanging out and I'll see you all next time have a good one